Hello everybody. Hope everyone is having a good Monday. Hopefully I am coming in okay. Hi Solid. Hope you're doing well. Happy Monday. All that jazz. Yay stuff. Uh, sorry I'm so late guys. I had to work late. Servers were up and down today, so... Ooh, I just needed to make sure some things were done before I logged off and then I had to cook and um, thankfully Spawn helped out a lot while cooking, so um, it didn't take as long as I thought it would. Um, but yeah, I think session has already started, so we're just kind of have to like jump in and see uh, where everybody's at. Uh, the last time we played, um, we had just gotten to the town. We found out there was little thieves, and we don't know who the thieves are necessarily, but we follow the tracks into this little fort area. And um, one of our party members almost got killed, and then we tripped up some stuff, and now we were thinking about running away. I don't know if that's what they did. I didn't miss anything. Oh. <laughs> yeah. As per usual for a group. Um, but yeah, so that's where we left off the last time uh, we joined. Um, hopefully everything- oh fuck, I need to make sure- let me bring up my character sheet. <laughs> I was like, I feel like I'm missing something. I'm missing the actual character sheet and shit. Um, I do have- I meant to like put it in my description or my game title, um, but I do have my character sheet link um, in chat. You can just type in exclam Maggie, M-A-G-G-I-E. Um, and that will bring you to a link to my character sheet. Um, holy fuck balls. That is too big. She said never. Just kidding. Um. Gotta resize it just right. I'm moving things around on my screen, guys. So, bear with me. Okay, I think that's all good. I still have to set up the extension. Thing. The thing. Stream words. Hey, I got chat back up. Hopefully, it will be okay. Oh, that's so weird. It's going to be on, like, the other side of the screen, and I'm not used to that. <laughs> um, I guess this will be it. I feel like that music is kind of loud. Just a smidgen. I think that would be good. 
and then we'll see we'll adjust uh, everybody else's volume in a bit there's tailspire exclam tailspire i think is the command um if you want to check it out on steam it's a pretty fucking awesome dungeon builder so far it seems um, I haven't actually done the building as much as, obviously, our DM has, but it looks fucking gorgeous! Alright, let's get into... Um, oh yeah, I need to do the thing. The thing. That I am live in the Discord of things. Balls. Shit. Fuck. Balls. Oh, hey, there's me. <laughs> Didn't meet my own stream. It's fine. Everything's fine. Um, going live. B and D, goodness. There, things are done. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, I'm gonna join everybody. I'm gonna mute them though, just in case if they're like super, super loud so you guys don't get blasted. <laughs> um, let's watch stream. A row? A row? How are you doing? Excellent, excellent. This is some epic music, just saying. You hear the hokey pokey? Um, is my music too loud? <laughs> no, I was uh, hearing, I was, I was hoping to hear at least your taco song. <laughs> that, that's coming, that's coming. <laughs> Did you punch work in the face? I definitely wanted to. Mm. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, time to. We haven't done anything yet. Just have like... fun. Yeah. Excellent. So, uh, I was telling them earlier. Excuse me. Uh, that I kind of messed up the last oh, no. time, and it should have been a little bit easier going than you guys. Like and then the situation I put you in, um, <laughs> I read right. some of the, some of the uh, instructions for the campaign setting. So, what we're I mean I know last time they we said that the uh, somebody in there had caught you guys and was raising alarm bells. We're gonna rewind <laughs> just a little bit until after you guys defeated the Doragar in the uh, bunker here. Excellent. And then we're gonna right. take it take it from there. Okay. And let you guys like re-roll stealth checks and stuff like that because I messed up and I did not read the part where it was a group check, not a uh not single checks. Oh, okay. Oh. So yeah. that should have made things easier on you guys. So it's a <laughs> check mix? Yeah, check, check. Check, check mix. mix. The cereal. Got it. Did somebody bring milk? Uh, I'm a turtle. You can. <laughs> I'm a turtle. <laughs> I'm gonna say it anyway. You can milk me if you want. <laughs> I'm not even sure turtles are turtles? mammals. <laughs> no? Can I Google this thing in You can try. Oh gosh, no. <laughs> <laughs> you cannot milk a turtle. Oh, uh, you can if yeah, you're brave they're, enough. They're not ma uh, okay. <laughs> But for those who may want to know turtle anatomy, oh, no. I'm well versed. No. <laughs> uh, a turtle's penis is actually its tail. So that tail back there that you see on a turtle, that's a oh, turtle no. dog. <laughs> Even for the females? <laughs> I don't think the females have the uh, turtle the tail. The little tail. At least, that's, that's, at least that is for land-based tortoises. Is this something uh, you've made up and told yourself and made yourself believe over the years, or is this something that's actual? No, I have witnessed in-person tortoise sex. What about... <laughs> well, then. What well, about then. the Ninja Turtles? 
How come they don't have tails then? Um, it might be hidden behind their either. My theory is either it's hidden behind their shells, which is unlikely because the shells go up a little bit too high, and you can see those cheeks back there. Mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. More likely is that the mutagen made it so that they are infertile and basically eunuchs. Okay, okay, okay. I'll go with that. <laughs> that one sounds pretty good because I know what's the, what's the girl's is a girl's turtle name. What's what's her name? There is a girl turtle, and she she has a tail. Her name was. Uh, Venus de Milo. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Google says that males and females both have tails and that all of the waste and reproductive orifices are on each of their tails. Ah, okay. So the tail is the pooper scooper for the women and the men, but it also acts ooh, so they... Like the JJ and the BB. So that they... Yeah, okay. Oh, so they so when they get together. Hey, hey, hey! hey. Hold on, you're gonna go into a D. No, the Chinese finger trap. Is that where you're going? I was gonna say they're docking, but I like yours better. <laughs> I like. All yeah, right. I was gonna say the Chinese finger trap is the way better. For imagery, at least. Let's move on. <laughs> no, no, I want to hear about the Chinese finger trap. <laughs> you were saying. <laughs> Welcome to Dungeons and Dragons. Welcome to Dungeons and Dragons. I hope you enjoy your stay. Uh, um. So we roll for stealth. Is that so? Oh yeah. When when last we left off, you guys were coming up here onto the mountain of whatever the mountain's name is. Steve. Sure. <laughs> oh, we were never given a name of the end. Yes, you were. Hold on. I, actually, no, I don't think we were. I have very good notes. It is the map. This was the part where you were drawing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Give me a second. I will get the name of the mountain because it is relatively important. This was is like... Wanna hawk a loogie? No. This is the mountain where Kitsune knew jack shit about, but knew everything <laughs> about the town. <laughs> yes, that, that's basically what, that's basically uh, my understanding of it. <laughs> that's my understanding of it. I know nothing about this mountain. So in all reality, we don't know. <laughs> we don't know. We were never told. <laughs> I just picture the conversation and went, all right, you knew everything about the town. What, what do we do about this mountain? I don't know. I, I don't know. <laughs> um, what's the mountain? <laughs> walk, walk, Kill yeah, the mountain. Yeah, yeah what's the mountain? How do you... What's the mountain? I don't know. <laughs> this is, the mountain's name is Kelvin's Cairn. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh. Actually, no, I think I remember hearing that, but yeah, I don't remember. The town is called... Pear Konig, yeah. What's the mountain called? Kelvin. Kelvin. Or I'll Kelvin. It in Discord, just so you guys can see it, because it it is pronounced. Kelvin's Karen, like Karen? No, Karen, C A I R N. Oh, corn. Karen. Yeah, it's sort of like Karen, but not really. Yeah. It's Karen, Karen without the E. Karen. Um, you guys are not up into the mountains yet. Like, this mountain still goes way up into... You can't see the, the top of it from where you guys are at. This is just the foothills of it, uh, which is still a very treacherous path, as you guys can see with the crevice here in the center. Um, I don't know why, were... but I just suddenly thought, like, we're at, like, the side boob of the mountain. That's what came into my head when you said that. Just, yeah, just gonna throw that. Through. Just gonna throw that out there. Um. So you guys were hired to come up here because the townsfolk, at least the ones in the inn that you were staying at, uh, a lot of things were going missing. You were sent out here to try to see if you could find the missing items and return them. Um. They thought that that might have been dwarves that were... One person thought. Yeah. 
one, the Probus, the drunken seer, or speaker, thought that it might have been, thought it was dwarves who were coming into town and stealing things. Everybody else thought he was crazy. However, it turned out that it looks like you guys found a Duragar outpost, and Duragar are dark dwarves. So he wasn't exactly wrong, but he, there was no way for him to know that it could have been dark dwarves. As a matter of fact, just for those of you who are not familiar, I'm also going to put this in Discord. Woo, Duragar. I really don't like them. A picture of Duragar. And what they look like. What they generally look like. Yeah. I think uh, Jennifer's float. Oh! Kind of I like them. They yeah. are evil. They are very, very evil. <laughs> they are evil. <laughs> so you guys came up here. You... You killed one. Caught, well, you were caught <laughs> off guard by one of them. He shot a crossbow bolt out, nailing Rusty in the chest, uh, <laughs> almost killing him instantly. Rusty is a is a woman. Thank you. Instantly, um, Rusty uses uh, she her tin can. <laughs> please, please don't. <laughs> You're a ro you are a warforged. Yeah, so. <laughs> You guys were able to take out the Dorgar in the Hey Shiz. hope you're doing in well. In the bunker here by both firing <laughs> inside and then literally <laughs> firebombing him with a with a lit lantern. Yep. And we did a lot of things. <laughs> we um, crit him, we burned him. Fun. Yep. So now you guys were making your way through this treacherous pass here. You guys stop just before you see a what looks to be some sort of pit built into the wall up there. Side and, like, yeah, like That's a, right, the side boob of the mountain. The yeah, side like boob of the mountain. Thank you, Nori. Exactly. How you doing tonight? So I'm gonna have you guys go ahead and roll stealth checks to start. Cool. It's I okay. already this did. Is, it's is, a oh, 19. Cool. <laughs> Good start. <laughs> oh, the sneakiest of the turtles. Wait, how come this time it didn't say I had disadvantage? Uh, I don't Probably know. because you don't have your armor equipped. Do you oh. have your armor equipped? She, oh, yeah. she has. Yeah. yeah, so go ahead and roll one more time. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So with that, Dang, with those rolls, Lopez is the sneaky turtle, the stealthiest turtle ever. Ninja vanish. You know why she's super sneaky? Because while you guys were all up there, she was still trying to get there. That is true. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Um, because it's a group check, you guys were able to are able to sneak past without alerting. Cool. At least oh, is it. that because of Maggie and Slopez's yeah. amazing yep. <laughs> They are picking up the slack. Thank I you. got a natural one again. <laughs> so where would that put us? Like right at the entrance or? Yeah, you can make it all the way up to the entrance for me. Okay. You guys can arrange yourselves however you like. I'm gonna go right here. I think that's me. Yeah, that's me because I'm highlighted. Just kidding. Uh, All right. So I wish I had as, knock. as you reach the the doorway here, you can hear over the sound of howling winds and. You know, ice cracking in the in the mountaintops up here. Um, there sounds like there's something large past these doors. You can hear it. I don't want to say it's roaring because it's not making exactly angry sounds. Like it, it's not like 
attacking anything, but you can hear these large guttural snarls and the clanking of metal. Oh, I, I was gonna say it was a yeti, but... <laughs> huh. Uh, well, where's the harm in knocking? Yeah, from what you can tell, the door doesn't have any sort of locking mechanisms on it. You just push it? Please don't just push it. <laughs> yeah, as far as you guys can tell, it doesn't seem like it could be locked. Um, at least not from this side. What do you, what, what do you guys want to do? Um, can we slide it open and do a little peeky poo? Mm, peeky. Yeah, can we do a little bit of an investigation check? With my last roll, I would not like to do. <laughs> um, I would not like to. Oh, does this the door does open? Fold, oh, I, I can't tell because it's kind of dark. Does it fold open or does it come down? It opens outwards towards you guys. Okay, okay. I just want to make sure we don't go to sneak and then we, the whole thing just opens up. Yeah, it out, it opens outwards okay. towards you. Oh, so we got a fold. Is there a, is there a sign on it that says fold, don't push? No, oh. but there are big <laughs> animals. Uh, so you guys want to? So Jen, you said you wanted to like investigate it or like look like yeah you... like... okay go ahead and roll a investigation check let me see what's the best check um i prefer honey nut checks <laughs> okay. let's do a perception check eh no, an investigation check is fine. Ah, fuck. I want to apologize ahead of time, guys. Work? No, for this roll that's about to happen. Oh. Everybody does wonder. Anybody wants to. To, like, check out the door and see if there's anything. Oh, no. I'm ordinary. Um, yeah, sure, actually. Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, well, now I'm going to do it. I apologize. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes, perfect. And that Amazing. one. Good job, Jennifer Lopez. <laughs> um, from what you can see, this, this place looks... It actually doesn't look like it's been here for that long at all. A lot of this construction seems to be relatively new from what you can tell. Mm. The door does not look trapped or in any way. And it is completely unlocked. Can I, like, slowly open it and peek inside? Uh, you can try to. The, the doors are massive and... and very heavy. Um, if you guys are going to try to open the doors, go ahead and roll a... Trying. Roll an athletics check. Um, side Can question. Someone help me. Um, <laughs> do I have to? You know, well, if to. you wanna, if you wanna help, try and slowly open this door. I'm a negative one in athletics, so I'm gonna say no. <laughs> Anyone else? Or am I, I doing this by myself? I'm very good athletics. Okay, but cool. I roll my athletics check. Okay. Um, can. Can I see anything from where I'm being a statue? Are you still being a statue over there? <laughs> I don't know if you noticed because I blend in so well. With... Where are you? <laughs> oh, where am I, you ask? That's right. Find me. See, I do look like a statue. Hey, hey. You're the one on the wall, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey! <laughs> Up down. Not so. <laughs> okay, okay, fine. I'll do an athletics check. Alright. Okay, cool. Alright. 22. Alright, that is easily enough. This door, it, it cracks and, and doesn't really creak, but there is some, like, audible noise as ice starts to break away from the doorway where it was just frozen shut just from the the wind and and wind winter 
that that look, actually looks like it opened pretty easy. <laughs> All right. Second. Nobody put your characters in there yet or anything. Oh great. Uh, I wasn't going to. <laughs> Ray, what if are anything, you doing? I'm gonna go backwards. Oh there you go. <laughs> Ray, get down from there. Oh, it's that you. You're gonna be you you are going to be seen by the obvious Warforge that was not there before. <laughs> oh, I wonder if I could fit in with these guys. Turn a little bit? Turn you turn maybe turn a little bit to like the right, maybe? I don't know how to turn it. Wait, can we move the statues and replace the one with Jen or Ray? <laughs> You'll never know. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. <laughs> we need to replace one. One day we need to replace a statue with Ray. Here we go. <laughs> and see if they notice. No one will know. Oh, if I stay like this with my mouth open, which I can for hours because I'm a tortoise, um, they'll never know. Yeah, you just blend in. I just hope she doesn't have to fart because I had some carne asada nachos. <laughs> they'll think it's just uh, something in the sewers that's going bad. What sewers? <laughs> There's gotta be sewers. There's sewers in there. Sewers I mean, there's... in the mountain, Kitsune. Come on. You don't even know what the mountain's about, so don't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey, excuse me. As you open up the doors and peek inside, uh, this is what you see. This hall is devoid of any decoration of any kind from what you can see in the dark. Uh, who has. Does anybody have dark vision, by the way? Um, I'm pretty sure I, I definitely do. Jen yeah. does. Okay, you two should. Yeah, the two elves should. Warforge should, right? Like traits. Yeah, it would be under features and traits. I don't know if Tor. No, actually, no. It would be under senses. Oh yeah, is there a section for that? It's right under saving throws. Senses. I do not see where saving throws is. Oh, uh, over here on the. It's, right it should be under senses. It should say dark vision. Yeah, just above that. So yeah, you don't have. I don't have anything. Right above that, right above the word senses. What does it say? I just... Ah, okay. So you don't have dark vision, and let me double check our local turtle. Uh, turtle I do not turtle. have it. Okay, you don't have it. Okay. <laughs> cool. uh, I do have. Um, I, I can't be poisoned. Does that does that help? No. Oh. <laughs> no, that does not help. Unfortunately. <laughs> So it is a little bit easier for the two elves to see. Uh, you guys, it's it's pretty dark. Um, but this hall is devoid of decoration. A frozen well stands near a hallway to the east, and three iron cages are pushed against one wall. One contains a malodorous ogre with rotting, half-frozen skin and an empty right eye socket. It howls in despair at the sight of you. Another cage holds a pair of nervous goats. The third cage is empty, leaning against a or leaning against a wall near the cage is a wooden dog sled with ice clinging to it. Well, we know where where the goats went, and we know where the sled came from. <laughs> All right. Now where is everything else? Why is he missing the eye? Yes, because he's uh. From what you can see, he's he's no longer alive. But you said he's... Oh yeah, he's he's moving. He's an ogre. He's undead. <laughs> he's an undead ogre. He is a uh, he is a zombie. Me. Yeah, you guys can go in. There's a as you enter the building, there's a massive like drawbridge that you're you're stepping across that leads over a pit that leads deep deep down. This is so cool, by the way. Sorry. Is this the one with the ogre or the goats? The goats are... I think the goats are... You can't tell. It's too dark for you to see. Oh, my Oyanta. 
do you have any sort of torches or things that might help light up a light up a room? That's up to you guys. I don't have nothing to help you guys. Um, let me see here. Can any of our can any of our mages cast light? Nope. 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 I, I decided not to I go with that. Light is a, light is actually not a wizard spell. That's dancing lights. I yeah. Have a I did think about it. I just so didn't like the spell like that. Or... You know what? Actually, just here, hand me the torch. <laughs> <laughs> I at least have something to light a torch without having to do extra work. <laughs> well, yeah, I, I'm. I do also have a tinder box to light the. Torch. No, I'm not saying like you. Ha I'm not saying you have to roll anything or like. You can you can just light the torch. Yeah, I'm saying do you want to light the yes, torch? All right, all right. And who's, who's Gary? Well, I don't trust Jennifer Slopez with fire. <laughs> uh, why? He did an excellent job. He or I she did. actually got us out of that pickle with fire. Can we put it on the back of Jennifer Slopez? That'd be, be cool. I mean, yeah, well, I could. Cool. I have mage hand if we need it. Okay, that's fine. Whoever right. wants to anybody has you all have hands. Yeah, we I have mean... hands. We we <laughs> we don't we don't need to. I have this quickly torch. became a we don't need it. We're not peasants. We don't hold torches. <laughs> yeah, we don't. I, I mean, we could use mage hand to do it from a distance. How does that look, guys? Like. Oh, as far as being able to see my character sheet and being able to see the roles and stuff. How does that look? I hope that looks okay. I'll try to figure out something a little bit more friendly next time that's not so um, big. Um, I might continue to play with it while we're in stream, but uh, let me know if it's too distracting or whatever. Oh, it doesn't know. Uh, but uh, we'll throw another picture into the Discord. This is a ogre zombie. Yeah. Ogre zombie. Without the mace, or does he have Wait. the mace? He doesn't have the mace. He does Where's have everybody? weapons nearby, uh, but they don't. It doesn't look like he has them in the cage. The cage is locked up tight. So what wait, where are, the, where are the weapons? Are they like? Right outside his oh, cage. Oh, there they are. Yeah, they would be outside near the uh, near the dog sled, which is not on the on the map, but over here by the rubble. Um, is it the wagon? Yeah, there's a wagon. Oh, there's a wagon. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> uh, are the goats undead? I know that might be a stupid question. No, the goats are alive. The, the goats are alive. <laughs> Whoa. Actually, no, we technically can't because we're not we're not two sizes smaller than the goats. <laughs> and uh, like as you guys are investigating the cages, this this ogre starts like howling and starts slamming at the at the gates, trying to force it open. He can't reach through, but he's starting to make a little bit of noise. We, we, Jen, we you didn't. We you don't have sleep him. prepared, do you? Nope. <laughs> By chance. Nope. And there are two directions out of this. There's a uh, an open hallway to your right near the near the sled, and then over to the uh, left top left corner of the map. All right. So there's a you said there's an entrance to the right and to the left basically. Yeah. Yes. Basically. Does, is there anything near like is there any light or sound coming from either entrance? No. This place is pitch black. Hmm. All right. I guess what direction do you want to guys want to go? Part of me wants to free this guy. No, you, you want to free the undead ogre. That might be friendly to the Duragar, mind you. <laughs> if it was, why is it locked up? 
Is he lock up like Good you point. kennel pets? You kennel pets? Well, no. It's an undead. I don't know. I mean, teach faculties. Um, um, also, you do remember that when you guys were tracking this the sled here, something large was it was instead of dog. Mm. Um, okay, so okay, so yeah, you can surmise that this is what this is what pulled it. There's so, yeah, they are friendly. It is friendly with the Duragar, albeit only for a short time, probably. I wonder how they they um, magic. Oh, okay, that makes Ma magic. You might as well just say that. <laughs> Real. Um. Does it sound better now? So you guys want to go right or left? Hallway, right hallway. That's my choice, I guess. I didn't I realize I was muted. Questions. I'm sorry. Well, you in general the, the moment you can see uh, minus the torch holder. Apparently, my pedals aren't working. Oh hey! So, hi. Hey. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> my bad. So I'm like sitting here, like pressing my, my. No, I don't have sleep to prepare. I was just like, man. Uh, oh. <laughs> um. Hmm. Let's see. How do we don't have a cleric either? And plus, they couldn't even use turn undead. Huh. I guess let's just go right. We'll walk past it. Sure. It's Unless anyone disagrees. That's probably a good idea. I mean, we don't have anything else to do right now. Maggie, what do you think? Um, I think... Cause or rather, boy, what do the voices think? The voices say that we don't... I, I mean, I can do necrotic damage, but I don't have anything that can control the dead. Although, um... Everybody wants to ride this animal, but I don't think that's a good idea. That's understandable. Can I you want to make it my friend? Do you happen to hear any voices in this room besides the current family inside of you? <laughs> I don't know. Do I? Uh, no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> So, shall we? Yes. All right. Through the hallway. All right. So as you go through this hallway, it lean it leads to the right a, a little bit more. This hallway is relatively still just empty, and leads upstairs. He's still trying to get used to the camera. There we go. I locked it. <laughs> yeah, it's a little. It's a little tricky to get used to at first. Yeah, that I understand. Ah, there we go. There's the steps. I think. I think those are steps. Yeah. Oh, oh, I see steps. Yeah, I see steps. Those look very big for a dwarf. Oh crap, I don't, I can't see where, oh, okay, there we go. Uh, uh, I don't know if I can go up. I can't go. Is you there... probably can. <laughs> you probably can, just, well, I don't know how to. Oh, I'll, I'll be there, fire, so. I'll be there in a couple years. Jennifer's oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jennifer weakness, he's much like Claptrap. <laughs> you need help? Oh, hold on. Are we going too fast? I see what's happening. Are going too fast? The eye of sight for the height, is that what's the issue? No, I had uh, certain things. Hidden that oh, I... there's a door. Yeah, once you get to this point, uh, there is a door. It's It does look to be unlocked. Um, you don't know anything else about it at this point, though. You guys want to open it? Um, caution. <laughs> yeah, can we take a little peek-a-peek? Uh, yeah, go ahead and roll perception checks. Does anyone have detect 
I mean, I could cast it as a ritual, assuming that nobody comes in here within the next 10 minutes. <laughs> yeah, you can only do it for, like, it takes him 10 minutes to cast. What are we yeah, I don't have it prepared, so I have to, I have to do it as a ritual. Perception. Perception? Let's see. And you do have, you do have detect, not magic, but you remember. I have uh, detect good and evil. Yeah. Which... I'm going to assume I'm just going to, based on this place in general, I would detect nothing but evil in this place. Isn't that divine I sense? It, can I? Let me double check your No, divine, sen divine sense senses a type of creature. It's not detect good and evil. Detect good and evil is a spell. Is that what it says? Uh, it is, yeah, it is a divine sense, but I think because of her... Divine sense, I didn't have to you yeah. detect good and evil. Yes, you can de- Oh wait. Sorry. Oh, what's the, what does the rest of the future say? <laughs> okay, so you would be able to detect and, and know the location of any celestial, fiend, or undead within 60 feet that is not behind total cover. Yes. So you wouldn't you be able the creature to type through, through doors and you could detect undead. Oh, or sorry. devils. Or angels. Yeah, or angels. All right. Okay, I rolled a five. All right, you rolled a five for perception. Um, eleven. Eleven. Jennifer Lopez rolled a nineteen. So, yeah. and Maggie rolled a twelve. Okay, so with that, uh, anybody who rolled above a ten, you can hear movement on the other side of this door. It's unlocked and untrapped, as far as you can tell. Uh, but there, you can hear, like, somebody clomping their boots on the ground heavily, almost like they're, like, kicking snow off of, off of their shoes or stomping around heavily. Hmm. Does someone tell how many people are in that room? It only sounds like one as far as anybody can tell. Okay. So I guess, do we want to continue, or do we want to go back and go to see what's on I mean, the other we, ha we have the surprise on them. <laughs> I say we open the door and go. A anyone oh, opposed? Are huh? we just going to leave Roy Jenkins this? I mean, we, we have a free round of combat by technicality, unless they know that we're here. That is true. So let's Leroy Jenkins this. You guys right. ready? <laughs> yep. I've been dying to punch someone. Charge! <laughs> All right. Don't let me in. <laughs> Rusty. Bust down those doors. Are, please r kick down that door. <laughs> All right. Door kicks open. And as it does. Uh. I would uh, stay back back outside the. Okay, I just opened the door. Then we're gonna assume that I all I did was open the door. <laughs> Kick the door. <laughs> okay. Okay. And in, so the door opens into a large, nearly empty room. Snow okay. is drifted into the corners, and frost covers the stone walls. Three mm -hmm. barred openings overlook the snow-covered grounds outside the stronghold. This is the room that you guys saw from outside. Oh. Yep, where somebody was, this is the out uh, the Overlook watching for you guys. Um, okay. Inside is a Durgar woman who you, you kick open the door and you catch her off guard. She looks like she's just like, it looks like exactly what, what I said. She's kicking dirt off of her, her boots, or <laughs> not dirt, but snow off of her boots and shaking herself off. She, like, you definitely caught her unaware. But she's not a Durgar. She is a Durgar. Oh, okay. I did I? I? I meant to say Durgar. Oh, okay. I apologize. I mean... Well, you did say Durgar woman. Oh, okay. <laughs> A roll initiative. All this room? There is also another exit on uh, past her. Hi. So oh. go ahead and roll initiative, everybody. Woo. Cool. 
four. Woo, we know who's going first, definitely. <laughs> Good job, Ray. I rolled a four. All right. A four. And then we got a Maggie at 16. And a 13. Game log. Do you want some water? I'm going to go inside. Tea, if you could. Thank you. Mm -hmm. While I'm getting the initiative counter set up. And Jennifer Lopez. An eight. Sorry, it was being difficult. I always forget how to do this. All right. So first up is Hellring. All right. Um, I mean, there's only a second to show you the map if she's grabbing a drink. All right. Ran into the other team. All right. Can make a picture where I'm at. Can you see the whole like? I can't see the whole room. Yeah, I would show the whole room. Go over it and... Oh, like... Yeah, kind of a... All right, cool. Here, this this will help also a little bit. You should be able to see a little bit better. Yeah. Cool. There you go. All right, yeah, Elrin, you're up first. All right, um, so I probably would have my both my short sword and dagger drawn. <laughs> yes, yeah, so we're readying for combat. Yep. All right, and so can I like walk right behind her or move to right behind her? Like here? Yep. What the? <laughs> That's a rock. What? Oh, look at a big rock appeared. Oh, uh, double right click on the floor inside there if you can see it. And then zoom in a little bit. Um, maybe drag down the green bar a little bit. Oh, not that far. Yeah, right there. there. Cool. All right. Sorry, I put him in there and then, uh, it showed up. How do you rotate? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Control. Oh. <laughs> and right. Are you trying to rotate your own character? No, oh. oh, alt. <laughs> Rock. Weird. Yeah, I don't know why that... Wait, do you have it locked? No. Yeah, try locking. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> All right. All should rotate. Oh, I see where it's. 
All right, and I'm going to attack with my short sword and my main hand and two weapon fighting the dagger. Oh, it just did the same thing to me. All right, so you're gonna. All right, go ahead and roll it. All right, so short sword. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Right, nice, that's nice. It. And I'm just gonna roll the dagger, as well. Guessing not. That is a miss. All right. So short sword. Cool. All right. So five damage. Step stabby. <laughs> Here we do the attack animation. The characters will wiggle. Nice. There, there you go. go. Yeah. All right. You dealt five damage. That's gonna bring it to Maggie's turn. Um, I'm gonna move over here, and I'm going to do Toll the Dead. Oh okay. my gosh, yes. <laughs> I just do this, I think? Uh, oh. no, it's a wisdom saving throw. They make that a wisdom. wisdom saving throw for that. Is it wisdom throw? saving throw? I think it's wisdom. Or is it constant? I always forget with Toll. Uh, I'll double check it. Alright. Yeah, it's a wisdom. Like, they... Okay, w wisdom. Are, the target must succeed on a wisdom check serving, saving throw or take a 1d8. Necrotic Actually, 1d12 since they're not at full hit points. <laughs> That's true. Oh, does. yeah. That is true. They do extra damage. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and roll that. Oh, my bad. Wisdom saving throw. And what's the, what's the DC? Where, where do I find that? It should be... Oh, Go 13. to spells. Oh. They pass. There we go. Thirteen. Yeah, they they he pass or she passed. Okay. Cool. Oh. Well. <laughs> and that's, that's the only thing I can do, right? Yes. Yeah. Unless you have a bonus action that you know you want to do. <laughs> uh, I don't think I have any bonus actions. Nope. All right. <laughs> so then that's gonna bring it to Jennifer Slopez. Paco, Paco. Burrito, burrito. All right, let's get this. It's been a while since I punched anyone, so let me move to this lady's room. I guess her left-hand side. <laughs> so, am I able to reach? You should be able to, uh, because you guys would have been stacked up close to the door. So I'll, I'll give you the like benefit there. Here, right? Yep. <laughs> Son of a turtle. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Alt, Aha! If you hold alt while you pick it up, it just spins in a circle, so you can face whichever direction you want. Oh, I can't do it. Oh, yeah. Alright, cool. Thank you. you all right. Well, that's cool that you can lock it, so I can't stick around while you're all... <laughs> a rock can't appear in my face when I'm <laughs> trying to look at the map. <laughs> Alright. All right. Go ahead and roll your attack. I'm gonna hit them with my claws. So I just hit the little damage slashing thing, or the hit DC. Which one do I do first? Yeah, you hit. Roll hit DC. Yeah, let me let me pull up your character here. Roll hit DC, since you're punching them. Yeah. Punch them in the face. Okay. Do the thing. Do the thing. I just need to bounce it up right now. Yeah. Yes. Okay, and then did I roll the damage next to it after that? Well, uh, does it hit? It yeah. has to hit first. Oh, we got a 22. I, I mean, it can, I'm sure it hits, but... Yeah, yeah. yeah. go ahead and roll damage. Sorry, for some reason it's not showing the... There, it's the game log on that screen. So six damage, and then yes. since you have... Since you're a monk, yep. you get to do that again. You get to do it again as a bonus action. Yep. Woo, monks. Neat. Well, the unarmed strike, so I have to do that one, right? Yeah. So roll hit yes. and then see if it hits. Okay. Uh, 
uh, that's a miss. So you cool. missed on the second one, but you clocked her upside the head on the first. Okay, cool. And that's going to bring it to... Uh, she will be skipping her turn because this is a surprise. surprise. So that's going to bring it to Rusty. <laughs> Let's go, Rusty. Woo, Let's you get to go, go finally. <laughs> Did we uh -oh. ever try talking to this person? No, because no. he wanted to Leroy Jenkins this. <laughs> we wanted to Leroy Jenkins it, so we're Leroy it's too Jenkins late now. You tried I've to read... talk to the last one, you got shot in the face. Kitsune's already stabbed her. I've already punched her. Like, it's too late for talking. <laughs> also, Jen tried to freaking cast we... a necrotic spell on her. That's true. <laughs> Five feet, I pretty much gotta be right in front, right? Do I get a flanking bonus? Yes. What is that? Advantage. You get to roll twice and take okay. care of it. I am going to use my great sword. All right. Great sword. Ooh, that was a good one. That is a good one. Go ahead and roll damage. Ooh. You didn't really have to roll twice, but. Well, I mean, what if I would have? Yeah. What if I would have critted on the second? Oh, yeah, I roll, guess. Roll, yeah, roll your second attack just to be. Make well, sure she's you're not in the crit. She she didn't. <laughs> Oh, I see, I see. Ooh, 13 damage! 13 points of damage. That is a lot of fucking damage. That's a great sword for you. Yep. Nice, nice. Suck! Alright, that's gonna bring it back to Elrin's turn. This All right. war guard is looking fucked up. Ooh, um, uh, same advantage. thing as last time. He gets advantage too, right? He's flanking yep. too, yeah? Yep, oh, yeah, I get advantage on both attacks. <laughs> that's okay. a hit for the first one. All right, that's a short sword. I remember yeah. you rolled twice. I, I mean, oh, yeah. Just well, if, you, if you crit. Uh, well. Isn't that a crit right there? Well, <laughs> roll your uh, roll your critical hit. So you're gonna roll just normal, like like you would for a normal attack, and then okay. add your maximum amount to that. So, like if you your short sword is what a d6. Yeah. So, so just add roll a d6 plus your you'll plus six. yeah roll plus a d6 six. plus whatever, and then add six to that. Add your yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Right. Let me do that. Cool, uh, cool. So 11, 14. 14 points of damage. All right, and now the mm. dagger. Uh, you don't need to worry about the dagger. Oh. oh. You have her <laughs> in the back of the face. <laughs> Got it. So the back of the head. Yeah, you, you jam that short sword back through. Like, it severs the, the spine oh, at the neck. God. She kind of gurgles for a second and then drops. If this was Jen's old character, character, I bet she would try to keep the head. Um, I still want to search the body. Not my oh, best please. show. Well then. Still want to loot the body. Just what did she have on her? <laughs> um, she is wearing a set of uh, dwarven size scale mail, okay. and yeah. she also has a shield. Can Can Jennifer slope head? Well, is Jennifer. Is Jennifer Slopez a big turtle or small turtle? Uh, Jennifer Slopez. Not... She does not want to wear armor, and he cannot stay naked. naked. Oh. It's a monk. Yeah, she stays naked. Oh, we. Oh. This is an, and, that's not an option. And a turtle. So <laughs> her armor is her no. Okay. It's like that scene in uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Two: Secret of the Ooze. When yes. The the head in. So, yeah, they and they like dunk into their shells. Yeah. Third one was better. That's what I do. Um, you Whoa. Yeah. You. yeah, that is, that um, is a terrible opinion. You like the third you movie? Love the third one. All right, guys. Good Ooh. night. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that's an unpopular opinion. Oh, hi Z. Welcome back, Z. <laughs> you, you know, if you really want to leave, she also thinks that the Tim Burton Batman movie. Is the best Batman movie. I, think those, I, think those I mean, are, that one I can kind of get behind. They're Sorry. Very, very I love those movies. Yeah, they're great movies. 
Um, other than those, uh, other than the the armor, and she was carrying a war pick. Uh, I can't use that. Other <laughs> other than that, no uh, items or any of any kind on her. Like, what's a war pick? Like a pickaxe, uh, but used for yeah. battle. <laughs> oh, okay. You know, you know, like a pickaxe with like a hammer on the other end. Um, it's used for club and skulls and seals. Okay, sorry. I hear pick and I think guitar. You know, now I don't even know if I like the third one or if I like saying that because it bothers me. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. Uh, I mean, if you want to take any of this stuff, it's up to you guys. I don't I'm, need it. Does anyone need a shield? You said a shield? Yeah, a shield. I mean, none of us can actually use shields except you, right? Yeah, but if, if I use a shield, I can't use Yeah, th that's, a, that's a thing. True. I'm good. No gracias. No gracias. Okay. Um, there is another exit out of here. Towards... But can I can I check things? Can I check the? There looks like a trunk. Is there anything in that trunk? Is there? It's a pretty sparse room, other than like a couple of. These are old like barrels and stuff. It doesn't look like there's anything in them. There, some of them are like half rotted. Uh. Spoiled mm. meat here. No, it's just. Just old items that are decaying. Okay, okay. Decaying okay. barrel. We can move on. Yeah. So, is our option to go out the exit in front of us or to go back and go to the other side? Correct. And the exit Those are our options. Or we could go back to the town. We or have we a lot of options. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. Um, based on the fact that this exit leads to Narnia. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, <laughs> to Narnia? So do you guys want to go through that exit, or do you want to go back? Um, what do we do about this? Can we shove that body into that trunk? Oh, yeah, let's do it. Sure. <laughs> Alright, uh, cool. Jennifer Slopez uses her, her beak to <laughs> the body and drag it to the... I don't know if you've seen how you might be doing all this dirty work. Robot, like, you could easily pick her up. <laughs> Oh, He's literally like four foot two, and here you are making her put this dirty, nasty dead body in my mouth. When when Jennifer Lopez has hands, because she's a humanoid turtle. I, I, can't touch I feel like this is gonna so far. Oh no no no! You guys me and Swap Meat Ultron over here have been <laughs> at each other's throats essentially. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah. You guys want me to get rid of the body? No. Go ahead. I mean, I'd like like it to be out of the way. Yeah, I want to hide it, please. On it, I have to give permissions. Give me permission to touch it, and I don't remember. <laughs> give me permission. Consensual. I mean, you, you... It has okay. to be consensual. <laughs> it has to be consensual. Okay. Consen <laughs> there it is. All right. The, the permission was given. I'm gonna just throw out the window. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I need this I mean, that's right. <laughs> That's one way to get rid of a body, I guess. The, uh... <laughs> the patrol that was walking by just, just at just that right exact body. moment looks up just to walk, see this body flying out the body. window. Well, so you slammed it up against the bars of the window. <laughs> just like, oh, trying to like mush it through? You're just trying to like push it through a little slit in the window? I tried to bend the bars, huh. maybe, but... Wait, where did it go? It's right yeah. there. It's so... It's like right here. Oh, oh cool. Um, I like how we talked about we putting it in the trunk, and she's yeah, like, nope. <laughs> Mush it through this narrow slot here. We're just gonna force this shit in there. <laughs> We're kind of like, uh, what, what, what's, what's this thing called? Uh, that's that's bedroom time later. Oh, oh wow. Well, hey. I don't know. Oh, uh, like a yeah, an accordion. Yeah, can I just accordion the, the dwarf and then... Oh my god. Accordion? <laughs> really? <laughs> it's already <laughs> tiny. Real messy. Okay, okay, fine, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Oh, we'll uh, what's the best container? Just, just put it in a container. Put yeah. it in a container. Whatever container we find. This is Hitman okay. now. I mean, There's I'm not gonna lie. Inside of a container. Okay. Mushing it through the window sounded like more fun. I mean... Yeah, until a patrol just suddenly, for some reason, decides to walk by just at that moment. 
by I that mean, I'm time. sure there'd be like blood dripping down like the snow and shit. I mean, I think it'd be pretty obvious. Although I do kind of imagine like these dwarves, like morticians or whatever, is gonna like look at this body, try to examine it, and be like, "Man, this body was brutalized after death. Like, <laughs> what the fuck little, do these people have against this woman?" Little do they know we were just trying to. That's all it was. <laughs> okay. To Narnia. Um. We gotta mush something through a window at one point, guys. Now this has right. to happen, whether or not we want to get caught up. Oh, oh my god, it's almost like waffle stomping her through the window. Pretty much. <laughs> Pretty much. I, I mean, we could drag a body back here and try to do that. Let's go get that goat. Oh my god! I'm pretty sure the goats were from the town. Okay, but they don't know that the goat's still alive. Like when they ask us, "Is my goat? Did it make it?" No, no, it did no not. we we kind of pushed it through a window. <laughs> they brutalized it terribly. I can tell you what they did to it. Through a window. They would do that. What? That's all I'm going to say. Is they pushed it through a window. You need to yeah. not know anything else. Yeah. These, guys are, these people. We're sick, man. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> All right. Anyways, to Narnia. So through the exit or through the other room? Uh. I to Narnia or through the other hallway or room? I say we continue down this path. Yeah. Right? Is All that right. is that well, consistent? Or... Yep. I'm not gonna eat speak myself. I'm just going to the edge. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't eat yourself into the mountain. <laughs> Ooh, I see what's down there. Oh. Okay. Can oh. I start? start walking down the stairs. Is that okay? That's fine. Let's start walking down the stairs. Oh shit! All right. <laughs> uh, as you Jennifer walk down the stairs, you see another room with piles of equipment that are pushed up against the walls of this room. Ooh, equipment. What equipment? At the southern end of this chamber, an open hatch reveals a route leading underground. Ooh. Well, what equipment do we have? Nice, uh, Nori. If you're... Okay, so you guys are... If, you're, if you search the Did room... Did you drop pictures in the okay. Discord? I have been lurking in your streams, you dude. I just... I can help find them now. I've been major lurking in streams um, lately. There's... Awesome. I'll check that out as two soon as I've done streaming. Two more suits of scale mail, size for dwarf. No. Uh, two more steel shields. Three war picks. All right. Uh, nine javelins. Ooh. You want a javelin? No. Uh, <laughs> Ray, you could actually probably use those. Yeah. Actually, you you're Ray, you would probably want the javelins since they're okay. your best ranged option right now. Uh, two climbers kits. I'll, I can grab one of them. What things well do you climbers, need? Other climbers kit. Okay, and four mess kits. For what? Uh, rations and, and things like, like. I want those. Yeah, sure, I, let's just grab all of them. I don't need so. That's fair. Yeah, you guys can have them all. Uh, let's just I grab eat. all of them. Yeah. <laughs> one each. Yeah, so we need to write all these things down. Yeah, I wrote okay. down what I have at least. Do you want me to write down what everyone's taking? Uh, I would, uh, yeah, write down everything that you guys are taking and then kind of split it up. Okay, so... Nine, if you're taking all of them. I don't want a javelin. I just want food. Two. Okay. And then what was the next thing? Uh, uh, two climbers kits. And me and Kitsu? Yep. I will write down that I'm taking a... have now a climbers kit. Okay. And four mess kits. Um, who wants one the extra each, mess kit? No, Ray doesn't eat. Oh yeah. Do, you take... Do either of you want the extra? Yeah, I'll take it. Okay, sure. I got it. All right, climbers kit, mess, um, mess kit. Are you gonna uh, add them to our inventory oh. after? Is that you can add them for yourself if you want to, but yeah. Oh. 
And with the mess kit, how many rations were it with it? Uh, that I don't know offhand, it doesn't say. So let me pull it up real quick and double check. Because me mess kits don't actually come with rations by oh. default. Thanks for uh, stopping by, Nori. I appreciate uh, you, dude. Have fun. Two, okay, mess kits. This tin box contains a cup and simple cutlery. Um, you're right. It does not come with it naturally, but I will go ahead and say it comes with two set or two. A day full of uh, one day of rations each kit. All right, so like three meals. Got it. Yeah, um, give or take. So, so one day is worth of rations. Cool. All right. Uh, the only other thing in this room outside of like the gear is the trap door that is already open. And I, I believe, I mean, can we assume that this trap door is going to lead to where we set outside where we're outside i mean it could also lead into the main stronghold okay where's the trap door at? it's over here in this uh it's a little bit under. like it's you can't see it while it's over oh, 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 oh there oh, we oh. go i see it uh, okay, okay. all right cool uh the trap door would be more on the side of things there but you can't really put that there um if you guys climb through it it leads a 20 foot ladder or a 20 foot tunnel underground uh, has a 20 foot tall ladder at each end of it uh, the when you go through the other end it comes out in the bunker here that we found on the first fire. Room, the Duragar okay um I mean, if you guys want to loot his body, go ahead. <laughs> we already saw what he had, but... Yeah, he has all of the same gear that the others did, the scale mail, but he's not holding a sword. He's got a... Oh, the heavy uh, cross the crossbow. Heavy crossbow. I mean... Uh, I'm good. I don't need to go down there. And they still, they still for a I'm lot. good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab it. Okay, uh, it's, it's one heavy crossbow with ten bolts. Okay, cool. One heavy crossbow, ten bolts. I was gonna put him in his own, but... That's fine. Crossbow bolts. How many you say? Ten? Ten. Got it. Can we write that down or no? Since He's got it. it. And other than that, there's nothing else there. It looked like it was just a pretty open space. Uh, looks like this is just where people go on lookout to make sure nobody's going to be sneaking into the outpost. Okay, so I guess then we start making our way back to the other side? Is that what you guys want to do? Uh, sure. We have nothing else to do right here. Sounds good to me. Is there anywhere you need us to, to stop in particular? No, but just back in the main room with the... Okay. the Can I try dragon. to give my food to the to the creature? Any what? Can I yes. try to give my food to the creature? To the zombie ogre. Is what I'm assuming she means. Yeah. yeah. Either that yeah. or the goats. Just because the zombie ogre doesn't mean it doesn't like chicken alfredo, bro. Exactly. It... Okay. Oh my God. Uh oh, wrong button. <laughs> so it was like extras crawling on the ceiling over here. <laughs> uh, so are you reaching in? How are you? Gonna... No, I'm oh, just no, going to be very now. cautious <laughs> and just kind of throw it in. All right. So you you kind of like I'm like you know throwing little chunks of food at ducks. All right. So you, <laughs> so you toss like pieces of it. This is mostly like. Like lembas bread or like hard tack. And we um, yeah. It does not seem interested. It starts rattling the cage and roaring at you again. Can we, oh. can we do the goat to him? We want to be the goat. We would have to try to shove it through the bars. Because <laughs> I ain't fucking opening the cage. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, okay. <laughs> um, wait. <laughs> we, we could try t throwing the goat over the gate. Is... No, 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 no. I like this one better. <laughs> we have to push the goat through. <laughs> oh, great. Now I had to say, the bars. push your goat through a cage. <laughs> great. Now I had to say that. <laughs> no, I'm good. I'm good. I, 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 my experiment is done. I try to make yeah. friends. It's undead. Another thing to do it to a goat. <laughs> it's, it's undead. You're not, you're probably not going to get it through normal food. Are we moving on, or are you guys fucking with the goat? Nah, the goat. I'm not. moving on. Goat goat. I have no reason to mess with the goat right now. I mean, I have a lot of reasons to mess with the goat, but <laughs> I, got, I gotta stick with my team, apparently. I mean, you don't have to. Is there two paths right Quite. here, or is that just a little incomplete? That's a little incomplete okay. right there. It oh. would be over... Here? The right. No, the other way. Here. The right. Oh, okay. Is it... Oh, oh, okay. Oh, wait. Yeah, that doesn't. I don't. Wait, wait which. Nothing is looking. Is there nothing here? I, is there two? Oh, oh I got a dead. I see. Is there two pathways? No, it should just. I think there should just be the one. Because there's one closer to the wall with the door. You're dead, guys. Or I don't know where the fuck I am. And then there's the one we're top? currently at. I think the one over there. I feel eaten, like it's this. I think it, that no, that one's eaten by the uh, by the hidden value. I see it here. There should be a wall there. So where you guys are at is right. Okay. Okay. Uh, so as you head into this room, you see a long room divided in the middle by two open doorways. I see myself uh, now. In the far southwest corner, an iron lever sticks out of the wall. Okay. Oh, oh I loaded. Okay, cool. Can I send? Mage hand. Pull the lever, yeah. Kronk. Pull the lever, Kronk. Mage hand. <laughs> are you gonna Are you gonna pull the lever? Uh, with mage hand, yes. Okay. It's all the way in the back far corner, far right. Corner. All right. Can you light it up a little, if that's possible? Or is this is what we see, that's fine? I mean, I see farther than you guys, but... <laughs> you would see further, let me see. I would see further, too. Yeah. Never mind. Yeah. I see spikes. So, yeah. Um, leave her with Mage Hand. Is that a door? Where's the lever? Where's the lever? What happened? That thing is gonna open the cage to the ogre. Oh my god. If it does, you guys are gonna be sorry I didn't push the go through the slab. <laughs> Actually, probably not because it would have prob probably still killed us anyway. <laughs> Could have still pushed the go through the slats. You don't understand, Katoon. <laughs> It might have been distracted by the goat. The goat that it would probably have already eaten. <laughs> but then we could have like hidden, or well, you guys could have. I'm just a giant uh, turtle. So. Uh, I could have just hidden my shell. You All right. Turtle when you so you you cast Mage Hand and have it pull that lever. As you yes. do, uh, uh, spiked bars. Oh slide up from underneath the floor and cut off your path. Good thing we didn't go further than this, huh? Or maybe yeah. good, bad thing because, uh, well, what else happens? Is that it? That's it. Just a big ka-chunk as... Well, can't we just use it again to undo it? Can I flip the lever back? <laughs> yep. So as you flip the lever back, they disappear. Excellent. Well, good good thing. Um, so, <laughs> shall we keep an eye on the lever? Yeah. Can we make yeah. sure? Can we do like a like a perception check just to make sure that's like the only thing that triggers these motherfuckers? That it's not like some kind of uh, a floor plate. 
yeah, go ahead and, yeah, roll a perception check or an investigation check, whichever you Oh, prefer. man, I want investigation check instead. I mean, either one works for me. <laughs> um, sure. Okay, I, I, I oh, see cool. nothing. <laughs> Alright. Hey. So, go ahead. Is that a gnat? Yep. Yes, that is... For me, that is a gnat. <laughs> nice. Alright. Uh, no, there are no other... Like, traps or anything like that. It looks like that lever is the only thing that controls these... The, uh, these spikes. We should keep an eye on in case... Yeah, they go get... all the way up into the ceiling, blocking off this half of the we should keep an eye on that in case we need to make an escape. We can pull that shit down and block off that area. I mean, isn't it on the other side? Kitsune, I swear to God, I'm going to stab you. <laughs> <laughs> we, me and him both have, like, spells, though, that could easily pull the lever behind us. Like, we could do it. That's what I'm saying. Like, we ran away, and there, there was shit an behind us. Yeah, yeah, there is. There I are mean, doors. Oh, well. Go through the I doors. What Kitsune is saying is, if you pull the lever... They can just pull it back. Because they're going to be on that same side. Not if they're on this side, not if we yeah, go back to the house. Here. I see where Z's coming from. So Where we go over here, and then we're like, oh shit, we gotta run. No, the lever is on the on the side of the door. Yeah, so if anything came through the doors that you guys oh. are Wait, in... And you I thought it was on the back. Oh, but, we back can right, still, so but we can still look at them. We can see the enemies come. We pull the lever, and we can still spike them. I mean, I, 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 mean, I know they can unspike themselves... <laughs> but I'm still saying we can still spike them. Like if there's like like a whole mob, we can get the front yeah, so two people. Yeah, so we could do is like even if we're if we're fighting, we step back a little bit here, and since the spikes were here, we can drop the spikes on them. Is what I'm saying. Yep. Oops. They can just unspike themselves, which is fine. We still do damage. I'm with I'm with Miss Turtle. All right, Miss Lopez. My... Sorry. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, at least you weren't trying to have to put dead things in my mouth, so <laughs> That's later, baby. Oh, <laughs> oh. oh it's dead. I mean I'll still like it, but So can we do a little sneaky sneak peek of what's beyond this door? Mm -hmm. do I feel like we should do the same thing we did on the big door. Like, kick it open and. No, no, no. Yeah, in there. <laughs> <laughs> kick it open. <laughs> kick it open. <laughs> kick it open. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Alright, what's on the other side? Do we hear anything? Alright, uh, roll. Pers well, you already rolled your perception investigation oh. check. Um, you. The sound isn't carrying very well in here because of all the stone and the metal construction. Um, you don't hear anything on the other side. Nothing, nothing big at least. So you're you can't really be sure what's what's through there without opening the doors. All right. Do one of you guys with the night vision want to see if you guys see anything and have maybe Rusty put out? Can I his, uh, slowly open the door and peek through? Have Rusty put out the torch or go somewhere with the torch so that the light doesn't come through. Sure. All right. <laughs> As um, Rusty steps <laughs> back, I'm going to slowly push open the door. <laughs> All right. Uh oh. Cutscene mode. Uh oh, things are happening. Ruffro Raggy. Uh oh. Ooh. I like where this is going. I like where it's going. Wait, what did I? Am I missing something? I see stuff. I know I'm not supposed to probably zoom in on here yet. Ooh, I see a bed. Can I push everyone through the door and run away? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you want to, go ahead. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I think okay, there's something I'll behind it. that. I'll save that for later. Is that right now, I, I technically... <laughs> Ooh, I want to jump on the bed. I want to ch check to see if there's something behind that picture. Well, I saw initiative mode. Oh, right. <laughs> put that picture in Discord so I can see it. Clearly. Ooh. No. That's bank bank material. Should I should I turn on the torch again? Yeah, I might as well. You probably should. 
since this uh, is initiative. Uh, oh. So as you start opening the door, it's it's still heavy and very loud, even though you're trying to be quiet. It, oh. Oh. Yeah, thought so. And oh. on the other side, you see another Duragar behind his desk. Uh, it's like he, it, you, so what you see is a stone carved bed and desk occupying this drab room. Atop right. of it are several shards of dark crystals, as well as a crumpled up piece of paper and a burlap sack draped over a glowing object that emits I colored light shifts from blue to green to red. <laughs> wow. Well, we found the lantern, I'm guessing. We did. <laughs> Important question uh, Is there any other female Duragar underneath the desk? <laughs> 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 It looks like uh, this Durgar is sitting be sitting at this desk, and he's <clears throat> writing on some papers or, or shuffling through some scrolls. And as he hears the door open, he like snaps his eyes up towards you, huh. and stands <laughs> up, ready to basically ready to fight as soon as he sees the door opening. Prepare to fight. That's all I can say. <laughs> Prepare to fight. Uh, go ahead and roll initiative. Initiative. Hey, you guys, we should try to take that lantern, though, as proof. Oh, for sure. We're gonna ransack this bitch. So let's not yeah. use it to try to do weird shit and break it. Well, I'm not going to, but hear me out, though. <clears throat> Was I talking to you? Oh. I was. I was specifically talking. Also, I was incorrect earlier, guys. That other door does lead somewhere else. Oh my god. Okay. I was I thought it was I thought the So there's two was... Yeah, there's two. Got it. The well that's probably that's probably okay. for later. Go through this room. I rolled an eighteen. Okay, you rolled an eighteen. One second, let me. Twenty-three. <laughs> Why do I roll two high on initiative? <laughs> I rolled a nat on initiative. <laughs> you really want to go first, that's why. I, I don't. You I have do. gone first every combat. I don't want to go first. Hey, I want to go first. <laughs> I, I, for once, I just don't want to go first. Last time, yeah. I mean, that's what devil says in bed, but it still happens. <laughs> 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 Did you hear the? I, I did. I did. <laughs> He's like, I did, and I didn't appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> Good joke. It's a great joke, even. <laughs> but I'm gonna need you to stop. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, let me pull up. He keeps hiding my fucking initiative track over here. So. See that TikTok? Why did that just say player character? <laughs> there's a player character. Generic person. Oops. There's the Derek player character, I guess. What the fuck is going on there? <laughs> One second, it's being dumb. No worries. No worries, it's... Oh. While you're doing that, so we're gonna take this orb back, obviously. Yep, Ugh. take the lantern about this, back. About this goat. <laughs> we are taking the goats back! We are not shoving it through the cage! Hear me out, though. Oh, no, we're gonna need those goats, but we gotta take the sled back, y'all. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I mean, I'll pull the sled. I'm a turtle. But... But I wanted to ride you. You can. If I'm pulling the sled, you can ride my back as I'm pulling the sled. But I wanted to flip you over and use you as a sled. I mean, that can still happen. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Surf uh, ninja, that bitch. Yeah, so... <laughs> They didn't they lose if I'm not mistaken, they lost three goats. And there's only one left, so there's no point in just taking one back. No, there's two. Was there there's two? There's two goats. Yeah, there's two goats in that in that cage. And, and so maybe one they got lose? eaten. They had three. Yeah, they had three initially. Okay. Okay, so all we gotta do is take one back. And say the other one got the other two got eaten? Uh one of them got eaten. We can take one back. The other one we just never found. That this is the only survivor. I imagine There's... this guy sitting here going, "Are they?" Where's... What happened? Okay. <laughs> he got eaten by that ogre, obviously. All right. Sorry about that. Okay. Uh, as 
Up first is Elrin. Uh, um, I mean, I guess I'm gonna do the same thing I did with the other Duragar. Um, just walk up and stab. Okay. Short sword and dagger. So he can go. I um, mean, I can go seven. Can go seven anywhere. Go... Anywhere in that room. Okay. Do I, I, I know where the Duragar is, obviously, since I saw Yeah. All you so yeah, can I... Oh. Oh. Can I walk up oh, to him cool. and stab him with... Alright, All right. go ahead and roll your attack. Short sword. Let's go. Mm. Let's oh, well. go Elrin. And then dagger. Mm. <laughs> Not a good start. <laughs> All right, both of those are men. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> Can I hit the the? Oh, I, I, that's my turn. Next up, it's his turn. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Was nice knowing you guys. Bye. <laughs> does. Can I chant Oompa Loompa? <laughs> Absolutely. Please start. Holy Wait. shit! I take it back. Now. Did he? Did he cast enlarge? So as an as a uh, a reaction. Oh, as a reaction. Oh. No, nope, no. Nope, this is an action. This is just okay. a, this is a normal action. Okay. <laughs> uh, he looks at you and yeah, basically casts enlarge on himself, growing to about twelve feet tall. Oh, you know, I should have expected that. I wish I knew how to do that. <laughs> this does seem I like... Uh, yes. You know, I wish I had Counterspell right about now, but I don't. It's not a, it's not a spell, it's a racial ability. Oh. It is? Okay. Yeah, they can all do this. You just haven't given any of them a chance yet. <laughs> Wait. Well, I, I, yeah, that is good, but we weren't prepared for this. Ooh, ooh. It's just, uh, never mind. Go ahead. <laughs> all right. Uh, he can't move, and that was his action. Okay. So, Rusty is up next. Um, Currently, there is an elven wizard <laughs> in between you and the giant Dorgar and a desk. You might be able to go around the other side, but from where you're standing... How much damage does those javelins do? Uh, 1d6 plus your strength. Yeah. So you would have to, yeah, you could throw it from here. I and, just like... and also, it, it since it's a thrown weapon, it uses your strength instead of dexterity, just so you know. Uh, and I believe you get disadvantage on it because you're throwing into a melee. I could be wrong about that. What about... Yeah, if you're throwing within melee range, you get disadvantage. Yeah. Okay. Melee or if you're, you're if you're throwing at long range, you get also get disadvantage. You're not in melee range. You have an ally in between you two. This guy's big, I can't... You figure I can't get past him? You can definitely try to get past him. Um... I mean, you could walk closer and get a better shot. Yeah, you can probably make it in there and around that, uh... I just don't want to be in anybody else's way. Can I stand on the bed? You're the only other than the monk. You can you can make it all the way to, like... Yeah, stand on the bed. Or can I... Can I make it? Because make... I'm not going to be able to punch him. Yeah, you can make it to right there. But then, yeah, then... Uh, Jennifer Slippers can't get into range. Yeah, the the table would be considered... Uh... What, can table dance on him? Uh, shit, difficult terrain? Don't... Yeah, yeah, that's difficult terrain. So you can still make it over it. Right. Or uh, Jennifer Slippers will be able to make it over it. Is there a space for Jennifer Lopez to to land? On the desk. 
And that would still be within melee range? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so then, yeah, I'm gonna go right there. Is this considered flanking? No. Okay. And I'm gonna use my great sword. Alright. And I am gonna... Huh. I miss. Oh, no. Well then. Oh, okay, so I was incorrect about getting disadvantage on a ranged attack. He would get bonuses to his AC instead. Yeah, that's cover. Yeah. Um, but okay, so what you what you want? Plus seven. I plus seven. And that's gonna bring it to Maggie's turn. I'm gonna cast my toll the dead. All right. So I will roll his. Wisdom saving zero. Oh god. I just remembered. I'm already not doing so well. Yeah. And he failed. So hey. he's gonna take the D eight damage. Kapow! D8 of damage. And he, he's not missing any hit points. Yeah, though, no, is he, he is he? not. Not yet. Not dealt any damage to him. You are the first. Yay. You it show up? Yep. It okay. Well, it's damage. Yeah. At least that. All right, Jennifer Slopez. All right. I only got two moves here. I'm gonna walk up, get on this table, and punch the shit out of him. Like, that's all I got. Robinson. Uh, however, yeah, I'm gonna hit him with the uh. The unarmed, the unarmed strike, not the claws, because I figure the bludgeoning would probably be more useful since he has that shield than slashing. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Don't oh well me, you missed. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So go ahead and roll it. Roll your attack. Fuck, I missed too. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can still attack again because you have monk. Right. Yeah, you're a monk. All right. Cool. Why don't you, you miss twice? Hours. Does that give her talk to shit? Oh. Well. Thanks. And damage. Yeah. <laughs> I'm about to get smashed by that giant fucking hammer, though. Y'all are. Y'all die. I'm leaving you behind and running. <laughs> All right, that brings it to Elrin. No, she's a wizard, not a yeah, we have two wizards, a, a paladin, and a monk. Oh no. Ray, you are our best healer. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's You're both the tank and the healer. Because <laughs> I am still hurting. Yes, we know. He's leaking that WD-40. All of us will, we. Um, He's leaking that's this, me. that WD-40. You know what? I am going to spend my last spell slot to cast False Life on myself. What does that do? Temp HP. Yeah, temporary HP. Let's see, how uh, much do I get? Seven. Nice, nice. And that's my turn. <laughs> you should have cast it on Ray. She's down health. Uh, it can only be cast on myself. You should have posed as Ray and cast it on her. <laughs> uh, if only I could. I got a disguise kit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. All right, so that in in that case is gonna bring it to fuck the dwarf or the dwarf. I keep saying dwarf because it's called it's a, it's a dark, dark dwarf, warrior. dwarf warrior. D D W. I mean, basically, it is a dark dwarf. So. Double D W. Yeah, just how it looks. <laughs> Double D wiener. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. You got that work, Loomy. Are we all gonna die now? Probably. I'm probably not gonna die. I'm still by the door. I would like to point out you did, like, you know, you did have that crossbow. 
Yeah, I did have that crossbow, however, I'm not proficient <laughs> in it, so... <laughs> Small PSA, if ever during our D&D campaigns you hear what sounds a one. like someone chewing on corn, um, slurping, licking... The devil. Me. No! Our cat sits right next to the microphone. Mm -hmm. And, uh... And she was just bathing right now, and I was thinking, oh my god, what if you just hear... Alright. <laughs> it is going to, uh... Target the elf in front of it. Elrin. Yes. <laughs> oh yeah, and I still have mage armor on, so it's probably been less than eight hours yeah. since I cast yeah. it. Yeah, you've still got that on. Yeah. Yeah, alright, that... <laughs> is it a nat 20? I don't like that laugh. Is it a, is it a crit? No. I don't like the laugh, but then I'm okay because it's not having any meat. That you know no. of. It was not a crit, but it is definitely a hit. Alright. For a total of... Oh, fuck. Four damage. Oh, that's not that bad. Cool. Amazing. I thought you were going to say seven. <laughs> if it were seven, that would actually be my entire hit point. Yeah. But you had that plus seven from your temporary. I know, but still, it would be my entire hit point pool. That doesn't take away the facts. <laughs> All right. That, that would have just knocked me unconscious right then and there. Mm -hmm. uh, Rusty, it is your turn. Okay. Okay. We're going to try again with the great sword. I give it a little, this time though, I give it a little like. No, no, that's too weird. Oh, okay, wait, this, we're gonna try the great sword. Well then. You missed? I rolled a nine. <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> we rolled ones. I Yes, you did. What happens? I, I'm i going to give you guys a little bit of a break this low level because it's so easy to kill you anyways. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. You know what's oh. in that? That took out... That could have taken out half my hit points, probably. Yeah. Actually, no, well, it could take out my hit points. And then, like, I do that thing, like, when you, you were a kid and you would play tetherball really hard, and then you would just... You grab the rope. Yeah, the one on the rope? That's right. It's oh, like, what? What is that? I would have hated I what it. Tether ball is. I, <laughs> oh, tether. I, didn't really, I didn't really play it that much, though. <laughs> oh, man. I used to throw down in tether ball. I used to get heated in the court. Right? Uh, mm -hmm. When I was in elementary school, some kid broke his arm playing tether ball. Oh, oh yeah. You hit, that, you hit that little metal piece where the ball touches Wait, the Wait, Ray, what? <laughs> No, I did. She thought I said somebody broke their nuts playing, and I don't know how that. Happened, <laughs> how did you play tetherball? <laughs> how, how are you I playing? That's one you do that. the ball. I don't know why. How do you do? How do you do that? The guy who was huh. nuts split open, and then everyone, and then someone said he was dead, and then everyone came to you thinking he was dead. That is a whole like you're off on all of that. He had testicular torsion, which meant his nuts Ooh. didn't tear. There was a leak in him. No, one of the. <laughs> Oh my and god! Endings that holds it to, it holds it on like one of the veins. Um. Off. Oh dear. Spinning around in circles. It's not. It spun around and then it cut off oh. circulation to itself, and swelled up and almost died. I guess technically that's acceptable. Uh... <laughs> well then. Yeah, it was it was bad. Uh, he was in the hospital after getting surgery on it. They had to have emergency surgery that day. Um, he was in the hospital with a guy from the local rodeo who had his legs stomped on by a bull and the guy's leg had like bone turned into powder no bone wrap and that guy said how he's glad he was not my friend because that sounds like a lot of fucking pain <laughs> it is literally one of the most painful things that can happen to a human being like it is on a scale worse than, like, childbirth, apparently. It's pretty rough. 
I don't know about either of them. But... So, anyways, uh, Maggie, it's your turn. Like, can um... we give this guy dead things and you can record you? <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna. Adventure Bros about it. Wow. About him specifically? Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna cast Witch Bolt. Huzzah! Alright. You rolled a. 20? But not a nat 20. Just a 20. There we go. I think. Okay. Okay. Good. Still good. I think for you where it's kind of loading. Yeah, it just took a long time to load. And then, so my damage. And then with Witch Bolt, you keep concentrating on it. And I can keep... So you can just I... keep doing damage, right? Yes. Sorry, I don't know what that other roll was. I accidentally must have clicked something. My bad. Ignore that. Oh, I guess it did... Did that automatically? It said lightning damage three and then lightning critical damage seven? I don't know why oh. it did that. Yeah, that it might have been like a... It's been, it's acting a little bit weird on my end right now, so. All right, so that's gonna bring it to Jennifer Slopez's turn, unless uh, unless you're gonna move or do anything else. Nope, I'm good right here by the door. She didn't do both damages? Cause I think that the thing was telling her no, no, one was rich, she said. In the next round, it she just deals damage. So she didn't do three and then seven? No, it's just the three. Two different types of damage? Right. All right, so it's my turn. Mm-hmm. Fuck him up. Gonna have to roll the punch, man. That's all I got. Actually, are we able, before anything, before we continue this, um, you said we saw the orb in a bag, right? Yeah, we saw the lantern. Yeah, it's on the desk that you're, it's like over next to you. Is that where I'm standing on? Um, yeah, kind of look over, like, there, you can see a glowing thing. So That's I guess what my question is, is can I grab the bag and then hide in my shell with it? I assume you can. Wow. I don't want to do that. Like a, do that. Let's like it's not a, a crazy magic item or anything like... Eh, I changed my mind. I'm going to punch him. So here we go. 16. That's a hit. Yay. Yay. Woo. Go. Boop. Four. First hit in melee range, or second hit in melee range, actually. And then All right. One more, one more time, right? Yes. As your bonus action. Your bonus action. Oh. Seventeen. Oh, that's gotta hit, right? Hopefully, I swear to God, it's a hit. It hit. Yep. Some of this. Five. So total of nine. All right. Nice. Nine fisting damage. All right. So he is looking a little worse for the wear. Uh, he is starting to get bloodied. Uh, he's starting to get very angry. Uh oh. I don't like that part. Elrin, it is your turn. Same as always. <laughs> stabby stabby. Stab 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 stab. Short sword. Dagger. Yes. All right, both of those are a hit. All right. Yeah. One damage. And then the dagger. Eleven total damage. Yeah. All right, so you stab this guy again. You get, uh, you just lay into him. <laughs> wow. No. Hey. And his body starts to deflate and shrink back down in size. Uh, <laughs> Me too. And he is absolutely dead. Sweet. Yeah. So, I want to check behind the photo. The painting. There's stone wall behind the photo. <laughs> oh, there's nothing hidden? No. Ooh. Check under the sheet. 
So we're gonna ransack the body and check the whole room. All right. Yep. You're, you're gonna ransack. Uh, so as you guys start looking through, um, there's a couple of things that you find. Well, before we do that, can I pull the lever for the spikes? Yeah. To kind of like protect guard our backs. To block to block block off. Um, yep. Anyone from getting close to us. Good idea. Good idea. <laughs> So you go ahead and do that um, as they're, and then the re- while the rest of them are searching the room, um, yep. Jennifer Lopez said that she was tossing his sheets. Uh, oh. As long as it's not tossing the salad. In the in his bedroll on on that bed, uh, you find a coin purse. A. Hey. Uh, the purse contains twenty four gold pieces. Fuck yeah. And 17 silver pieces. Yo, I'm rich. <laughs> Yours. <laughs> uh, the rest of the room is pretty clean. There's nothing of value here except for um, on the desk, you see a couple of like dark crystals. Mm-hmm. Can I do an arcana check on the crystals? After Wait, how many, what, what was the stuff? I didn't write it down. 24. 17 24 gold, gold and 24 silver? Other way around. 24 gold, 17 silver. Okay. Can I grab one of the crystals and see if it's... If, yep. If, go ahead and roll... Yeah, go ahead and roll an arcana check. Hmm. 15. All right. Uh, you know a little bit about this item, like the, these types of crystal. Uh, just make sure I'm not saying the wrong things here. All right. You're like, if this crystal will grant you the most magical powers in the world, <laughs> actually it's poison. <laughs> well, <laughs> thanks, DM. <laughs> You're gonna be the strongest wizard ever with cancer. <laughs> Thanks, DM. <laughs> Thank you, DM. I really appreciate that. <laughs> Alright. Ah, here we go. It's fucking under the role playing for some reason. Uh, so you know a little bit about this this crystal. It's called Shardolin. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I think I did that earlier. <laughs> Pretty sure I That's Shardolin fair. Basically, it's only found here in like the Icewind Dale area. Uh, it's usually used to store magic inside of. Uh, so it is relatively, like, I don't want to say valuable, but it it's valuable to the right people. Would it you know, be? this is actually valuable to me. I will oh, take to the, the, our wizards, yeah. Uh, yeah. Unless anyone else has any objections. Have... Yes. Overruled. Can, yeah. you, can, you store, can you store people in it? No. Wait, what? No, it is magic. Oh, yeah. I was say... I was gonna say, do we have Greg back? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> no, this this I was stone is always like cold to the touch when you when you hold it. And what makes it special is that it's really good at taking enchantments. So if you if somebody's trying to enchant an item or make a magical item, this is a really useful stone to have because it helps. So basically, soul gems from Skyrim. Yeah, it makes it real easy to infuse. I just basically wanted it. We got Greg. No, you did not get Greg back. <laughs> oh. hmm. Sure, I'll take some of them. And How many are there? Let me take a look here. Uh. Looks like there are three dagger-sized pieces of Shardolin. 
Oh, damn. What those are you quite, eat? Oh my gosh, those are big. <laughs> um, and then there's also the, like, if you... It looks like the lantern you guys are looking for is in a burlap sack here. It looks <laughs> like you tried to cover it up because it was very bright. It, it was glowing. <laughs> it was. <laughs> yeah, oh, damn it. Thought it, I just thought of something, but it's... Yeah. Oh well. Alright, um, I'm um, gonna ha hand one of the crystals over to Maggie. Thank you! And then there is a crumpled up piece of paper. Looks like that's what he was writing on. Let's read it. We Can can't read, read Duragar. Does anybody read Dwarven? No. No. No, <laughs> I read Celestial, Common, Elvis, and Primordial. I mean... Oh, I can speak to... I mean... Uh, I could this. cast Comprehend Languages, however, I need 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> you say, uh, Jennifer? Uh, I can speak to fish. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, dwarf that's about fish, same got. thing. Yeah. I have if, if, if he has, like, a goldfish on his desk, maybe. <laughs> Alright, so... Can I take you, the note to bring with us? Yeah, uh, yeah, it's just a crumpled up piece of paper. So that, um, maybe we can I mean, oh yeah, or he's ten, he's back in, in ten minutes, and well, ten minutes or an hour, and I can cast comprehend languages. We can also try to capture one of these fuck faces and try to make it read it for us. Well, they're kind of dead. Well, they're kind of dead, and also no, wait, hold we'll on. have there's, trouble communicating there's... with them. Maybe. <laughs> Isn't oh, that, yeah. Isn't there that other area? Didn't Devil say that? Yeah, exactly. Door? There is another area. Is another so you can go stab somebody else. The, but we still can't area. talk to them. So. We, still, we still can't get them to. Here we are. What are we going to do? Just like <laughs> shove the face of paper in their face. Yeah. Hopefully yeah. they. This is what you do you grab them and you hold them by that window slit and you show them the paper. <laughs> and if they don't read it, we push them through. <laughs> You know what? They might read it just in Dwarven. <laughs> <laughs> They'll speak in Dwarven so we can't understand. Look, I gotta do something with that window slit or this goat. Like, you guys aren't giving me much, <laughs> much to work with here. Okay, wow. So you guys are back out, I assume, opening the trap. Yeah, uh, undoing the trap because we can't walk through spikes. Sure you can once. <laughs> yeah, once, but I'd rather not do that once. Okay. <laughs> I mean, you can if you want. I won't stop. I don't you. want to. I already got spikes <laughs> on my back, bro. Like I don't need any more. Okay. What just happened? Whoa! What's going on? Apparently, I dragged. Uh, I'm like, it wasn't me. I swear. Her on top of a mountain instead of. <laughs> get get out of here. We're going to where the other room is. Yeah. Um, Devil can. Yeah. Can you type the name of the crystal in chat so I can get yep. it? Shardling. Yeah. Let me. Yeah. Let me copy paste it so I know I'm. Type copy correct. pasta, copy pasta. I want right, some right, right, noodles right. now. All right. And now, oh. this uh, this room here is kind of just a hallway that leads up a, another set of stairs. The hallway itself is free of any like adornments or anything like that. Can you unlock it so we am I just, can... Am I just chilling? I'm just going to chill in the throne room? Like, that's just where I live now? Yeah, Thank okay. you. I realized that, uh... Oops. I let go of my character. It happens. I mean, I'll live there. That's fine. Um, there's food. There's a dead body here. Thank you. Yeah, this, this oh, little... Oh, is there a trunk in this room, by the way, before we left, that we could put the dead body in? No. Well, no, I mean, it didn't look like it. We could... under the desk. No, 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 we'll just stuff it into the bed, pull the blanket over, and make it look like he's sleeping. Ah. Oh, I was gonna ask Jennifer Lopez if uh, she ate. <laughs> if I... If you, if you eat, they're gone. I ate, I ate anything. <laughs> I'm like Maggie from the Life commercials. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you look there. Yeah. Uh, lizard bow for cannibals. If anybody yep. wants to play with those next time. I'd rather not because I don't. Oh no, you want the elephant. I will play with it. I'll play the elephant. <laughs> I'm down to play whatever. I don't care. I'm just here to have a good time with friends. Sorry. Sorry. You're here to have a good time. Sorry. So we, uh. All right. What do I do? Where are we? As you Heading go up? up, like, yeah, as you guys ascend uh -oh. the stairs. Oh. Hang on, where are we? There we go. Oh, crap. I got it. Ray, what'd you do this time? I was trying to go up the stairs. Oh, and there's nothing there. You can just oh. drag the green. Drag the green thingy and it will good. Where the I fuck am I? Stairs and then everyone disappeared. And then we disappeared. Use your green. Unlock yeah, drag your green. Oh, that's what you meant by drag the green. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I will right click on the floor in there where, where you can see it. That way it'll, it'll set the the height. Where are you guys at? Oh, over there. Yeah, drag your green. There we go. Hey. I'm with the group. Oh my god. Last is das. Too much. Too much green. Too much green. <gasps> I see a table. Ooh, I'm gonna dance on it. Is that a shitter? No. <laughs> Kinda looks like a shitter over here. Yeah. These look like shitters. Yeah. They look like little stall shitters, and no one Yeah. Knows. They are, they are not. Uh, oh. We'll get to that in a second. Uh -oh. oh. I don't like how many of these are. I, I, it's, it's frozen for a moment. Yeah. I'm concerned with how many spaces there are, because we've only killed three, and there's five slots here. It looks like there's doors leading down to somewhere, too. Yeah, probably should. We might want to leave. Oh, now we want to leave after we Leroy Jenkins to every fucking room we've been in. <laughs> but I want to see all the stuff. Do we have a health potion for what's her face? <laughs> uh, no, we don't. Oh, can I do? Can I do while we're before we walk up? Can I do long hands again or lay lay hands again? Lay on hands. Yeah. Wait, do you even have any left? Yeah, I've only used it once, and I get to use it one, two, three, four, five times. No, you have a pool of five hit points. Okay, I get to do five hit points. Oh. You have a pool of five hit points. It's your total five. Oh. <laughs> I'm thinking of it as spell slots. Yeah. No. Well, I what's up with the jazz hands? Yeah, we uh, we have no healing. We have no ah, spell slots. Okay. <laughs> Well, we have what we need, so at this point, any exploration is just that exploration. Yeah. I feel like we've already walked in here, so something's probably going to happen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're probably right on that. Probably. Oh gosh, the DM said probably. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh no. Here we go. That's when you know something is actually going to yeah. happen. When, every, when, when the DM is quiet. <laughs> When the DM squad and then suddenly speaks. I, I, I'm mostly fighting Tailfire here. Ah. Uh, okay. Well, it's okay. So something <laughs> will happen. Yeah. <laughs> We're doing the same thing, too. Alright, there we go. So as you guys enter this room... Why did... Why are there doors closing? Oh it's god, it's like little stalls. Oh, they look like prisoner camps. There we go. They look like the rooms that have the padded walls that are really soft. Uh, as you open the, like, come up around this corner, this chamber appears to be a cell block lined with stone doors that have small barred windows set into them at dwarf's eye height. Snow and wind enter the room through a barred window in the northeast corner, that looks out towards the snow-covered bunker that guards the main entrance. So, this is a room that looks like it's full of cell doors of some kind. Let's right. look inside the slots! 
That's... I, got, I got arrested for that. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm so sorry. Can we take a quick... Before we keep going on, does anyone need a quick pot break? Yeah. Hey. Just me? Uh, yeah, I mean, you need to go sure. with that. Hey, just go ahead. We're not. I didn't know if it's been long enough that you wanted to. Fine, I just need to grab something, anyways. I'm standing on my tippy toes, trying to peek into the hole. I mean, it's that dwarf height. Oh yeah, <laughs> I'm bending down, <laughs> trying to, to look through the pee pee holes. I was gonna say, does anyone want to pick me up? Um, sure. I don't have a reason to. Well, sure. Anyone, anyone pick I'll me try. Up for these? Let's see. No, no, we're good here. <laughs> I just like this table, and there looks like there's a map over here. And... Food on the table looks like. Or am I wrong? No, there's mm -hmm. the the table's blank, but the there's like a map table. See, I see food on the table. There's be there's four settings of. Four play settings of like looks like soup. You might need to adjust. Oh, there we go. There we go. Now I got it. I got it. It was just off just a smidgen. Rock. Rock. Ray just Ray just moved someone and there was a rock. As as you peek through this, I'm talking. You see what looked to be. If any of you have played The Last of Us. Yep. I think the uh, the infected, so they they look like people that have mushrooms and plants growing Ew. out of them. Oh, like, oh so they basically the humans from the yeah, kind okay. of like think, think more like uh, zombies, but instead of undead, they're fungus. Mushroom people. Yeah, fungus and oh, plants out of them. So, so these are people that are oh, controlled Mykonid? by fungus. Yeah, myconids. They're myconids. Or are they uh, like the candy? Are they mycanids or are they actual humans with they're mushrooms? Humans. Okay, so they're like mycanids. Got it. And I try talking to them. Uh, they they don't really seem to speak. Okay. Um, what they just kind of shuffle about in these rooms. Are there any voices mm -hmm. in my head coming out? None of, no, no more than normal. Okay. Bang the door. Any one of these will I give you the ability to us. speak to them. <laughs> uh, no, no, you get no response other than just mindless shuffling in, in like, and if you peek into each of these rooms, there's a total of five of these things wandering through. Uh, some of well, them look like okay. they're they're human or originally were. Some of them look like, uh, there's one of them that looks like it used to be a dwarf. Ooh. Well, they can't understand us. Do well, we they know? can't, but can can we show them that, uh... Oh, well, they don't speak the same language, huh? I don't think no, they're they speaking at all. Do we know what this is? Well, what is? What's affecting them? No, you've never seen this before. Like, I know it has a name officially, and I, I, I don't know what that means, so I'm just curious if... Yeah, no, you, you're you not... None of you are sure what's affecting them. Okay. You, it's nothing that any of you have ever seen before. Okay. And then at the opposite end of this room, there's another set of, of doors. Um, just like all the others, these are unlocked, and you can assume untrapped. Can we sneak? Can we peek through it before we enter, please? Absolutely. So if you open, once you open the doors, these actually open oh. very quietly. Um, and this looks like, like sleeping chambers. 
I like to sleep with food. Um. You need to get the fuck out of here. <laughs> There's a lot of, uh. I put myself on the table and it ate me. So. Oh, I'll be on the table. Stand on the table. You probably have your green thing set a little too low. You're, you're on the table still, right? Oh, there we go. Okay. Sorry. Uh. I want to look at this, the map. Some of these room doors are open and you can see sleeping Duragar in at least one of them. Which one? How many? One in the, in the back corner here, where, where you first came in. Here? Yeah. Oh. Do, do okay. we want to just like step, hit them all at once? One in each, one in each door? We only see one right now. So we only, only see one, but the sounds you can hear snoring coming from the others. Okay, we should leave. Yeah. Um, it says, uh, small, ro small rooms flank a central common area where crates and sacks are stashed against the west wall. <laughs> Doors of the two southern rooms are open. Oh, sorry, I guess, uh... <laughs> oh. Uh, and you can hear the faint sound of snoring coming from each of the rooms. Do I need a then do a sneaky thingy before I look over there. As long as you're... As long as you're actively trying to be quiet... Yes, uh, I'm actively oh, trying to be quiet. I just want to look at the map. What does the map say? I'm gonna see. I'm, I'm gonna stay by the door. Okay. Um, the map itself over here... Oh, this is a freaking cool looking map. Shows it, it looks a little bit like a map of the Ten Towns area. Um, mm -hmm. You can see where where you're at there. It's got the like right here where all these red red pieces are. That looks like where you're at. Some of these are other other towns in the area. It doesn't look like it's to scale, but it's an idea of where some of the towns are. Anything discerning on there, like? There's like a, a little attack figure or a red mark X. Anything like that? Nope. Okay, fine. Can the only, I... the only other thing you see in this room are some like sacks and small wooden chests. I don't know if I want to risk going through things. I'm okay with leaving things behind. I kind of yeah, want to take a sip of ale, but I will not, or take a sip of whatever is on the desk, but I won't. I just wanted to see the map to see if we could gleam anything else. We should leave. It's I'm good with way. that. All right. Anyone opposed to nope. leaving? Nope, 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 nope. <laughs> so um, how do we, do we want to just go out the front door? I mean, isn't that the only way to go out? <laughs> No. That we know of. Wait, yes. Yeah, that is the only way. Yeah. That is, isn't that the, yeah, exactly. Isn't that the only way to go out? Leads to a place where we can't go. Okay. Well, we can go. We just can't go out that way. Um. Apparently, I someone's going to play out this group. Oh, go ahead. Mm -hmm. See? What? What were you saying? Oh no, uh, no, I just thought it was like, apparently somebody's gonna climb out of the mountain and just be like, fuck this, I don't need the door. Me. <laughs> ah. Just, just a heads up, you do rem you remember that other things were stolen from the town. Oh well. He wants to go mm. fight the thing. No, I'm not saying fight the things, I'm just saying you do remember that. Yeah. So, no, we found everything that was taken from, oh no. no. From the town, I don't know why I We found the goats, we found the oh, lantern. We, go, we found the lantern. And there's another three things that were stolen. Yeah. What were those three things? That important. I have them right here. Um, we found the magical light that changes coat. Oh, yep. the pair of coats. The small smack, small smacks, small sacks of pearls. Oh, that's right. Well. Okay. Um, I can I cast? Pearls. Can I go back and cast Mage Hand? <laughs> yeah. As long as. Uh, just to check, is a mage hand? Is that does that have a verbal component? Do you know? Um, I mean, wait, let me check. I, and I can. Yes, yeah. it does, but I'm probably just gonna cast it like far away so that the sound can't reach them. Okay, that, and, that, and then that like would... move. 
he's gonna I think he's gonna stand outside the door and use his mage hand to to grab the sacks of pearls and that's all I can do for you. Get... <laughs> well, no, you guys don't know. There's a couple of different sacks here. There, and... There's sacks on the table. I'm assuming uh... they're the pearls. So. Mm. Might as yeah. well just try to get them. Right There's at least two sacks here and two chests. I can only get I can only get the sacks unfortunately, <laughs> but if you guys want to get the chests, that's up to you guys to figure out. <laughs> as I Is try to cool? quietly grab the sack of pearls and yeah. bring them both to me with Mei Shand. All right. Um. So that well, you don't know what's in the sacks yet. Well, yeah, I'm so, assuming they're pearls. Once you take two of the sacks, um, one one of the small sacks as you open it does have the stolen valuables. It has cool. 25 pearls carved into decorative beads. Uh, right. the other We've sack contains three daggers, a set of woodcarver's tools. I'm gonna go cool. slow because I know she's writing this down. <laughs> a set of navigator's tools. Useful, I guess. Well, we can see if these are anybody's stuff, too. Uh, fishing tackle. Interesting. <laughs> a potion of healing. Ooh. I, can, I hand that over to Ray. <laughs> <laughs> I hand that over to Rusty. <laughs> 73 silver pieces. I'm gonna pocket those. Make sure you keep um, them in your so how many silver wallet. pieces? 73? 73. So the pearls, I don't think we should divvy up. I think we should give those back to who they belong to. Well, yeah. I didn't know that that was even an option. Well, you never know. Ah, very I true. lost they myself find, again. We need to find the pearls. I don't know if anybody's like. I mean, oh, I <laughs> I'm pretty sure people would notice that these pearls <laughs> look <laughs> look like. We can put the pearls on a string and store them inside me if you want. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm just saying, we don't want them to get lost. <laughs> Does anyone want daggers? Um, I, I will. I, I, I will store I'm sure them myself. Everybody. In store? I'll, I'll store them. Uh, wooden carver's tools. Well, now might not be the best time to divvy up. Okay, uh, yeah. Yeah, also that. <laughs> Back to the main room. I do, though, if that's okay, once I see him kind of look, because I am right here. I had the. Where, where am I? I was right here. You're still somewhere. Because I have my light on. Hey, where did you go? Yeah. Oh, you're... Jennifer Slopez is downstairs somewhere. She's right here. She's right here on, like, between the... Um, here, I'll move me. She's, like, right above the two cellar doors here. She's, like, on top of the cells. Oh, hold on. Let me... Let me do the Adjust green. the green. Ah, there we go. <laughs> um... Being quiet and not... Would I be able to be like, oh, I see that potion of healing. I'm going to take it right now. Like, you're going to drink it or you're going to... Actually, um, let's save it until an actual, <laughs> until a fight. Okay. Yeah, because you can take it during a fight, no problem. Okay. So I guess right now... Okay, yeah, I have it all written down. Okay. All right. Uh, you so you out, are... suckers. You guys are heading back down and out the main door? I'm yeah. already there. Alright. So, uh, going back out, you see no resistance. Um, you don't run across any other dwarf or Durgar. You don't run across anything else. The ogre zombie, like, roars at you again and starts shaking the bars. Are we stealing the sheep back? Do we have the sheep? Nope. Oh. Okay. It's a good labyrinth. But sorry, my thing is all... Thank you. Will you get the both of us? Yeah. I can't. 
weird when I like when I move the character is when the the walls uh come down weird. Did you lock your thing? I just unlocked. Okay, this is outside. Okay. Yeah, you're outside. Well, yeah, you're outside. Everybody should be outside. I'm not outside. Uh, are, are, are we gonna Are we gonna free the goats? I, I. Do you think goats are strong enough to pull a sled? No. Also, they're not coordinated enough. Oh, but can we just like walk we, with them? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Can we walk with the goats? Yeah, you would be able to kind of like rope them up and. That's what I am. Yeah. Let's do that. Yeah. All right. Um, the the wind starts picking up a little bit. Uh, more snow starts blowing through, but and it takes you. Uh, like, what time did we? You you haven't been here too terribly long, like an hour, maybe. All right. Um, we're heading back to town, or... Yeah, if you guys are heading yeah. back to town, um, back to town, you guys know the rough direction now. You don't have to worry too much about like trying to find your way again this time. <laughs> uh, the weather is cleared up significantly. The weather outside is frightful. From then, um, so you make it back to town without any issues. All right. Yes. When Mission we... accomplished, boys. I assume... When I get, can I do Go something ahead. when I get into town? Sure. Can I bang my war gong? Just to let people know we're here. You can. Can we I take a, a long rest, or do we want to do that later? I mean, long well, rest I we need hours of light activity, so. I think we need to still talk to them first. I don't think they're gonna let us sleep immediately, especially since what's his face. Did the gong, gong, so... Yeah. yeah. Also, also, like, do rest that... doesn't mean, like, actual I... sleeping. I did that to let everybody sleeping. know, like, <laughs> come get your shit, we're done. <laughs> so... Alright, I'm, I'm gonna... Well, yeah, go, go ahead. ahead, actually. No. I was gonna say, so, like, once you get back into town, um, the only people you really know are at the inn. Uh, when you want... When you walk back into the inn, you can see... Trovis, the uh, the speaker, he's this one sleeping is... lightly in, in an armchair there. Uh, Allie and Corey, the innkeeps, are going about their work. So I assume we're going to give... They were the ones missing the lantern, yeah? Mm-hmm. So we're going to give them the lantern. I'm okay. going to head to the militia barracks. All right. Um, can we get directions, I guess, on where to give everything else back? Or can we just assume we gave everything back? Uh, if you talk to Ali and Corey about it, um, they'll, they'll be happy to help you figure out who everything belongs to. You know that the pearls belong to the local market. Um, the rest of the stuff wasn't anything that was stolen from the town, as far as anybody can tell. So oh, cool. you're able to get the goats back to the tavern without any any problems. Um, the lantern they hang back up uh, above the door. They're they're extremely happy with you. They say you guys can stay here for free. They, you know they'll give you at least a couple of nights rest if you need it. I assume we're gonna tell them about what we came across. Is mm. that right, guys? Or are we like? Up to you. I'm just here to get back all the stuff I borrowed. <laughs> and yeah, you're able to, to give back the short sword. And can we... Appreciative. Can we ask anybody if they can read that piece of paper? Well, yeah. um, since we have time, um, mm -hmm. ritual, comprehend languages. Oh yeah, he can, he can read it. Okay. Here, hand it over, please. Here you go. All right. I did say, I'm sorry that we took your stuff. We'll be returning. <laughs> 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 you know, I wouldn't be surprised. 
Actually, no, I would be surprised. I know that they're these are evil people, But maybe they're trying to turn a new leaf. Maybe they're tired of being seen as these evil little angry people. And they took their funny. stuff just to give it back. <laughs> well, maybe one of the one of them just wasn't up to uh, like up to date on the new. Rules Sorry about Dave. He is yeah. new yeah. to this new lifestyle. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. what does the note say? Right. Um, so he as you us. as you cast your spell and and look over the note, it's it's very short. Uh, it says in a very heavy hand. It says. Brother, oh, you will fuck. find me on the frozen ferry in East Haven. From this new base, the search for Shardalin continues. Long may our father reign over this dark land. And it's father. signed Dirth. Papa? What was his name? Dirth. Shardalin. R T H. Can you read that one more time? Uh, I'll, I'll, Can you copy paste it? To I will copy and paste it to Discord to make it easier. Thank you. Oh, dirt. I just had dirt, like from, uh. <laughs> yeah, never mind. Do we know. Are we familiar with these places? East Haven is another one of the ten towns. Uh, do we know what they sacrificed there? Uh. The goats. Mm hmm. him through windows. Let me double check. I, I just, you know, want to know if that's a place where East, we shouldn't go. East Haven is, from uh, from the information you gathered earlier, is one of the towns that sacrifices humanoids. Well then. I think I'm a turtle. So wait, Ray, what was in the sack that didn't belong to anyone? Hold on one second. Uh, here, I can take a look real quick. It was... I, I, I mean, you can look if you want. Three daggers. I got that recorded. Okay, a set of wood carver's tools. Wood carver's tools. A set of navigator's tools. Navigate. One moment. Navigator's... Got it. And fishing tackle. Fishing. We could just talk to the fish and tell them to jump in our mouths. <laughs> cool. All right. Are you holding all of those? Yeah, I will hold all of them. Can I have the fishing tackle, though? Sure. Thanks. All right. Fishing tackle. Move that. Where did I? There it is. Cool. All right. Um, also, I would like to head to the blacksmith. Okay. And see if I can just like hand over the heavy crossbow and bolts for a price. Doesn't have to be overly expensive or very high. All right. Let me take a look here. Question that we haven't established yet. Uh. Are we a party that pools our money, or is everyone's money separate? Um, I would like to keep my money separate. Okay. Bring greedy that's ass. My, that's my <laughs> character. <laughs> I too would like to keep my money that separate. Okay. All right. Ethier says that I need to. And are you? Let me double. Let me ask this: Are you guys splitting the money that you guys got? And keeping it separately, or are you, yeah. like, who's who's like take just taking what? So I, I assume... figured we'd split it. If that's the case, then sure. are you um, that means nineteen silver pieces each okay. from mine. So earlier.
he found 24 gold. And I think that's the only gold that was found, yep. And there's how many of us? Four. Four, so six, e six gold each. So six gold each. And then, before you go too far, yep. uh, uh, Kitsune was selling that crossbow. Um, yep. Is he gonna pocket that, or is he gonna, or is he gonna... Um, well, first I'll see how much it is. Uh, he is willing to give you, since it's a, a decent quality crossbow, heavy crossbow, about 20 gold for it. And that, that includes the, uh, the bolt. Okay. Um, yeah, sure, I'll split it with everyone. Okay, so how much does everybody get so I can manage this inventory? So nine gold total each, right? Yes. Okay. No, wait, no. No, 11. 11. 11. Eleven each. Eleven. E I have eleven gold each. Okay. And then how much silver? Because there were seventeen okay. pieces of silver that I had plus whatever. Plus seventy-three. Wait, that's exactly one hundred. So twenty-five silver. Here we go. So let's see. Um. I'm going to add to make my life incredibly easy. Move. Um. How much gold? I already forgot. Eleven. Yeah. Eleven. Eleven. Mm -hmm. Speaking of which, hey Maggie, can I look at your spell book? Yeah. Um, maybe I don't know how to check my spell book. Uh, what spells do you have in it? <laughs> but I don't know how to check my spell book. Uh, go you to your, spells? click on spells. Uh huh. And scroll down. What first yeah. level spells do you have? It should be oh. any of the spells listed there. Yes. Oh, okay. Um, alarm. Missile or magic missile, unseen servant, and witch bolt. And I have message mold old earth and Tola dead. Do you want me to update the character sheets in Discord, Devil? Uh, if you'd like to, sure. I forgot we had that part of the Discord, honestly. Do you want me to delete all of these or just do a line and say these are our new characters? They just do a line. Um, you are. Matt, uh, Jen, just so you know, you are missing two first level spells. Oh. You should have six starting out. <laughs> just so you know. You didn't let me choose those, I don't think. Uh, you, you can still choose them. Devil can. She still chooses it. Uh -huh. Yeah, let me, yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll let you, uh, let me take a look at her character sheet and make sure that... She should have six spells, or six spells in her spellbook right now. So after oh. we everything away and we divvy all this stuff, what time is it? Um, it's getting closer to evening. Hmm. Let me see. I need to power it. Oh, wait. No, she does... She does have all of her spells, just... Oh, I see. Because the ones down here are not combat spells. She also has shield. She... Oh, shield. Hmm. I do? I see. <laughs> You just don't have it prepared. No, it should still show if you don't have it prepared. So, on her character sheet... Oh yeah, I have False Life, Feather Fall, and Shield, but they're not prepared. Oh, so I don't think it let me prepare them. Yeah, you can't prepare them. You can only prepare one plus your intelligence... Or your, le wizard, your level plus your intelligence modifier. That's how many you can prepare. But you should have six spells in your six first level spells in your spellbook right now. <laughs> okay, I do then. Okay. Um, what's the list again? Uh, okay. Yeah, here we go. Alarm. Alarm. False life. All right. Featherfall. Feather. Uh, magic missile. 
magic missile. Looks like you might have one extra spell here. Uh, shield. Shield. Unseen servant. And Unseen. witch. Yeah, she does have one extra spell. I was just doing things that let me. Pick <laughs> on. Although, I mean, if you want to spend the gold, you can get False Life in your spellbook right now again. I have it as well. Yeah, we'll, we'll take a look at that for next time. I just None wanted to prepared, so it's not a not a big matter. Yeah. Um yeah, I'll think I I know which ones I want to prepare for, okay. or write down in my spell book. And then uh, That is basically where we are going to call it for the night. Like we can do like the minor stuff here. Um can we say we take a long yeah, rest? Yeah, you guys will be taking a long rest, get all your spells back, get your HP back. Can you level up? And you guys will be level two. You will Yeet. level up. Yes, I get Blade Singer. <laughs> <laughs> yes, oh my gosh, I am so happy with that. I get Blade Singer. Oh my gosh, yay. Yeah, it, it, level one is an awkward level. <laughs> Okay, so wait. Why don't we? Why don't I just do this now? Um, so Devil, what's? How do you? How much is it to copy spells in the spell book again? That let me double check. And as always, if anyone needs help leveling, feel free to reach out to Devil. How do you do that? Because I'm gonna need help. Uh, I I can help you with that. Um. I would need Basically, when you go into your character sheets, mm -hmm. uh, you'll click on what it looks. Like. Yeah, click uh, on your, your your character name and then manage character and levels. Okay. And then switch the little drop down to level two. <laughs> what are What are we doing for hit points? Um, sorry, I'm also I'm AD, I have ADHD and I'm getting off track. <laughs> oh no worries. Um, hit points, I will allow you to either roll while, you know, while we're all together like this, um, all or right. be average. Your choice. Mm, I will, I will gamble and let's do a roll. Okay. Cool. And I get average. Or actually, that's less than average. Shoot. So how do we roll that? Uh, so you're character if you prefer to roll your HP <laughs> I want to do whatever is easiest easiest is just taking average which is it does it automatically so do I just, I'm assuming manage eight hit points no 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 uh, oh it it, it automatically did it auto yeah so let me Wait. take a look here for hit points. Yes. Okay, so that, then that's all we do, right? Unless anything comes up asking you to choose something. Like Ignore you... the pings in Discord, please. No worries. Um, like when you go to level two, if you see any like blue dots or something, like and it wants you to choose something, huh. that's the only other thing you'd have to change. Oh no, no, I'm good. Ooh. So it looks like you'll just use the override hit point, I think. Yes. Weird that it doesn't let us freaking. Mm. Oh, yeah, well. once you override it, it should uh, it should change your maximum hit point. Well, once you override it in long rest, it will change it back, I'm pretty sure. Let's check. Yes, it will. Oh, do I get spells again? 
You do? Yes, you do, Ray. So let me... How much is it to... <laughs> Holy shit, I get something called Furry of Blows? Oh, Flurry. <laughs> <laughs> furry of Blows. <laughs> Woo. Oh yeah, you get key points. That's right. He got Other excited because he, cause he read Furry. Oh. Did. <laughs> yep. I was like, yeah, all the hair on the butthole makes it worth it. Why is mine not working? For now, I guess I have to read this stuff to see what the fuck I'm doing. Devil, you're still looking up how much it is, I'm guessing? Yeah, sorry, I was looking at the uh, HP thing also. No worries. Um. Oh yeah, that's right. I also get two more spells to add to my spell book. Woo. So I can use the key points. I have two points for a short rest. Yep. Cool, so I can use these if I take damage. Take the disengage or dash action as a bonus action on your turn. You jump distance was double. Holy fuck! So yep. I can fly now? <laughs> Basically. Yo, flying nin mo <laughs> flying manga turtles. Hell yeah. What else I have? Hell yeah. Defense. One key point to take the dodge action as a bonus action on my turn. Get the fuck out of here. I can do all this stuff. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Alright, let's add two more spells. Because I get two. Oh, yeah, Jen, you get two more spells to add to your spell book. <laughs> so I can close this uh, thingy, right? I, I can close uh, Tail's Fire? Yeah. Cool. Oh, gosh, what do I pick for my two spells? <laughs> something flashy, something that can. I'll be back, uh... guys. Alright. Bye, Jen. I miss you. Bye, Jen. All right, guys, I am going to end it here. Thank you for hanging out. Um, I will um, be live again sometime during this week. I'm not sure. It just kind of depends on work. Um, I was, like, late today, and I am tired, and uh, I'm not sure what um, is all going to go on later on. Um but yeah, I will definitely post up on Twitter and Discord um, if I'm going to be live. Uh, solid. Thank you for dropping those links. Um, it's been fun. I, I, I love the fact that we're doing D&D &D and I love Tailspire so far. It sounds a little bit frustrating on the DM side. Um, so hopefully it's, n it's just a matter of getting used to it um, and not something that's actually broken. Um, but we can ask uh, Iron D later about that if it is just because he's unfamiliar or what's going on um, because it is really cool and I am glad that I bought this so far um, but thank you guys so much for hanging out I forgot to run my credits because I am a pro streamer one of these days I will have it all automated but for some reason it should be automated, but it, it's not. I don't know why. It hates life. Um, hello? Okay, so apparently credits aren't even working, period. That's fine. Um, but thank you guys for hanging out. Solid, thank you. Nori, thank you for stopping in. Same wishes. Um, Dro. Uh, I will see you guys all later. Thanks, guys. Love you. Bye.